Underground. Just walk away. Give me your pump, the oil, the gasoline, and the whole compound, and I'll spare your lives. Just walk away, and we'll give you a safe passageway in the wastelands. Just walk away, and there will be an end to all the horror. I await your answer. You have a full day to decide. center of Mars was a sack of souls with experiment scars when a second of the monk said, I'll take two, and he put them in a rock and then he ate a lot of glue, and he shot them to earth when they turned into babies, they were named Bob and Matt, and they rarely got rabies, and the monk made a movie of their whole entire lives, they were pen and extinct, then zooms of the thigh, and one time Bob had sex with a ladle, and one time Matt lost a bet to a cradle, and another time Bob caught a dinosaur mom, and another time Matt bought a replica of Guam, and all this more is on a DVD set, only twenty ninety nine with the purchase of a gym, but if you call right now and say, where's my whisk, we'll include this bonus disc. Hey! <laughs> Welcome to Bonus Disc, the only show on the internet, I'm Bob Rose, and with me is Matt. And today, our guest is returning, <laughs> former guest of the show, Jimmy Geiger. Hey, Jimmy. Hey, how you doing? Yay. It's Gigrich. It's Gigrich. Shit! <laughs> I said your name. Fuck! I should know your name by now. Yeah. I'm sorry, man. It's all right. You can call me Bob Rose if you want. There you go. <laughs> Bob Ross. Right. Uh, Jimmy. Yes. I thought you owned this movie that we watched, and I you did didn't. Not. I do not. You no. let me down, man. <laughs> We, we watched Neil Breen's Pass Through. Can you explain yeah. why you don't have it, though. Well, hold on. I got to tell him we, we watched okay, Pass Through, yeah. and then, yeah, okay, Jimmy. So, yeah. I think Bob thought that I owned it because uh, I went to see a showing, not of Pass Through. I missed uh, the tickets were sold out, sold out to that one, so they showed uh, his other movie, Fateful Findings, afterwards. <laughs> Uh, and I expected that they were that he was going to bring copies of this movie to sell. That's yeah, usually yeah. what happens at these That's things. How you make money at these. And things. when we got there, I asked the guy. I was like, "Hey, so where are the copies of Pass Through?" And the guy at the door was like, "You didn't fucking bring them." And I was like, "What?" And he was like, "Yeah, he just didn't want to make any money, so he didn't bring them." And so I never got a copy of it. I didn't. I, 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 I didn't. I didn't decide to spend thirty dollars on his fucking website. <laughs> They have a million yeah. DVD-R of it. God's beautiful. <laughs> I guess in my mind, I was like, like J- Jimmy met Neil Breen. There's no yeah, way right. he walked away without pass-through. No, no, he didn't have any copies of it. Dude, he would have sold one to every person. Literally ever. every person. Possibly yeah. not. You know what he was probably thinking is, if you there, there's no box art. You know I what I mean? There is. He, is there? Yeah, I believe oh, so. Damn. I'm pretty just like you pay thirty dollars, he mails you it in like a paper <laughs> sleeve. I mean, not that we're get, not that we're there yet, but I'm pretty sure the box art would be whatever that image at the beginning and end. Yeah, are. Like, whatever that's that thing that he got the off grid of Google images. Yeah, yeah. Google images. <laughs> when you look up space grid. <laughs> That's the cover. It has yeah. to be. Yeah. Yeah. So I, I mean, I apologize because no. I thought you had it. I it's was like, because I confirmed him as a guest and then I was like, see so you have Pastor? And you're like, no. Yeah. Like, and we've been talking about it for a little for a while, while too. I was like, okay, well, all right. <laughs> Luckily, uh, I Googled it and I found it on a, like a small Reddit post where someone had, had, had pointed out that when you buy it, he just sends you a link <laughs> to his like Dropbox. And then he, the guy just posted the link, and he posted a bunch of mirrors that he had made himself on other <laughs> media hosting sites. So the guy not only provided the original, but he was like, in the case this doesn't work, here's like five other options need for downloading. To to and then it's a bunch of people saying, why don't you support the artist, you piece of shit? <laughs> like yelling at him for stealing Neil Breen's work. And yeah. he's like, I'm not really stealing it. It's Here's a link to his Dropbox <laughs> that is not protected. <laughs> So you figure that the uh, world's top hacker, hacker slash right? techno Jesus would know to put a fucking password on his drop <laughs> Neil the hacker breed. Uh, password, what is that? I don't even know. 
Yeah, Man, that's I what mean, I'm saying. Like, someone needs to hack him. It'd be so funny. I, I, like, just to hack what, what him. What are they going to find, though? I don't know. Just to fuck with him. It'd be hilarious. He's got to be the most boring man alive. Yeah. <laughs> Let's be honest. He doesn't have any friends. Yeah. I, do yeah. you think he just stands in the desert staring at the sun <laughs> when he's not working? I feel like this is what he that's does. That's his process. He just yeah. burns his skin in his eyes and just lets the wind roll through his fucking Man, hair. Man, his, his, like, next movie is going to be about an eclipse or something. Watch. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like like everyone else is talking about not looking at the eclipse and he's like here's my chance to write <laughs> to write something about the one man who did look at the eclipse and jesus came into his body <laughs> through it. you know what i mean like he's gonna do something nuts like that yeah uh anyway we watch pass through mm. th- via my phone yeah and we're gonna talk about it in this, this, this <laughs> but uh jimmy the one thing i wanted to talk about before is you met yeah. him yes yes i did can is there anything you could tell us that's he awesome was, about like him? starkly normal like he was just <laughs> <laughs> okay all like, right no like honestly he was just kind of like i don't know like he was just a weird normal guy um i mean he's he's a fucking lunatic at the same time <laughs> <laughs> but he's just a boring lunatic. Yeah, but he's just kind of like people are asking him uh, one of the questions, and this is like I fucking lost it when he said this. Uh, somebody asked him a question. They were like, "Who are your influences?" And he was like, "I have no influences but myself." <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that's nuts. And then they were asking him how he made, like, how he learned to make movies, and he was like, "I didn't learn how to make movies." <laughs> No and then, shit. But no, and then he was like, "Well, actually, I watched a bunch of videos on YouTube on how to make movies." <laughs> <laughs> you know, honestly, those that like that's what I did too. Yeah. yeah, I mean, I feel like you can get a pretty good education on almost anything on YouTube. Yeah. No, I would agree. Did he listen to the video? I, <laughs> Jesus Christ! You know, some people watch them. He watched them with, the, with the sound, sound off. off. Yeah, with the sound off. Like no one explained to him the 180 rule or yeah, like right. continuity between edits right. or anything. He just, no, because he's not looking up like that type of shit because he doesn't know about it. He's looking up like how do I make an orb? You know what I mean? Move, he's like, I need to move from the middle of the screen over in this. one scene need, and then over into like, yeah. you know, I'm, the I, top I, know the next... I need to look into a tiger's face. <laughs> like, I need to, and that's what he that. types in. Like, <laughs> and he watches like a Photoshop tutorial, not realizing it's not for video. <laughs> That's how he learned. You know how many yeah. tutorials about like smoke he probably watched? Oh, yeah. Every movie mm. has like a smoke effect that's yeah. a different color. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. He never looked up anything about editing or anything. No, no fuck. No, no, no. A shooting <laughs> technique. No, yeah. he was no, just like, no uh, it doesn't matter. I know what it looks like. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he's so he's got to be an egomaniac though right yeah 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 no he he was like he's he very much thinks that what he does is art and like he thinks that it's like you know (laughs) very profound and i mean you obviously if you watch his fucking movies like it's just it's not the world it's not no 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 he's but he's just like you could tell that he's kind of like a normal guy who just got like a wild bug up his ass to like fuck (laughs) make make these fucking movies Just and, have to do it. And, to. and then he's just like, I think that he's just sort of like insisting that there are art and that kind of makes him a little bit exempt from cr- criticism, I think, in his mind. But the audience that was there, it was obvious that he, well, he left when, uh, he like, <laughs> oh, he, yeah, I'm sure he doesn't yeah, watch people watch no, his movies. Oh, man, no. that's awesome. Like, I, I noticed that because I've seen, uh, I saw The Room with Tommy Wiseau, mm-hmm. like, there yeah. and he introduced it and all that kind of stuff. And he did the same thing. Like, he, like, you know, I think that he appreciates, and I think this is the same with Neil Breen, I think that he appreciates the fact that people are enjoying his movies, but he hates the way that they're enjoying his movies. You yeah. know, I think that, like, he really wants them to be taken seriously. And so when I saw The Room with uh, and Tommy Wiseau was there, he kind of spoke, and then he just left. Like, he left the theater. He didn't want to hear people laugh at his movies and, like, all that kind of stuff. Um, and same thing with Neil Breen. Like, I think that he, he at least left from the screening that I was at, which is the second one. Um, right. I don't know if he was at the first one. I assume that he wasn't sticking around for it, though. Cause so you don't think he, he's into the fact it's kind of a joke? Yeah, I don't think that he likes it. Oh. Well, even in that... Um, I think it was in... We were just watching that Indiegogo video. <laughs> right. Talking about... We watched two Indiegogo videos yeah. before this. Um, yeah. He kept insisting. I think it was for Pass Through. He was like, this is not a midnight movie. It's a serious movie. Like, it's going to be taken seriously and all that kind of stuff. And you could <laughs> tell that he's kind of, like, aggravated that people are classifying yeah. them as midnight movies. And he even said himself, he was like, I, I don't like the term midnight movie. I don't like the term cult movie or anything like that. Like, he wants it to be, you know, like, legit. Because these are his and statements. It's, and it's the, it's the most fucking bonkers thing on the planet. Right. I mean... <laughs> 
I mean, having se- just sat through pass through yeah. to make that and not and like to think no, no, that this, that wouldn't be yeah. a cult movie. Yeah, that takes some fuck. Bl- that's like blinders. Yes. Yeah. Thick fucking blinders, <laughs> man. <laughs> like has he? That's what I said. Remember when we started watching? I was like, does he rewatch these things ever? Right. Yeah. Because I think it's like he just edits them yeah. once. Never we watches it from the beginning of the timeline and just exports it. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, yeah, I, yeah. I mean that, that I, it would make sense because yeah. no one could rewatch it and be like, yeah, yep, yeah, right. Got it. It's one pass, right? <sighs> one pass, and it's just like out. Yeah, I have the file now. Yeah, and this is the file for everyone. But uh, it's art, Bob. I don't, don't know what art is. Question is process. <laughs> it's art. I just, I'm just saying. I can't wait for apparently the two documentaries that are being made about him. Yeah. Because <laughs> I really just want to. I at the editing of it is more interesting to me than the shooting. Yeah. Because where? Because like it almost. I look at it like the last one we watched, and I was like, you could maybe put this in order, right? And make it make some semblance of sense. Yeah. But whoever did, no. it's a, they took it and they just like put it in a blender. Yeah. <laughs> like, Here's all the stuff that belongs in the middle. Shake it up. Yeah. And put, put it here, in. here, here, here. <laughs> yeah. And like literally storylines that are reversed and stuff and spread out. Yeah. Like, so what? Yeah. And then there's storylines <laughs> that are condensed into a block. Right. Like the Which fucking. We, we, well, we'll get yeah, to yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, <laughs> right. <laughs> Anyway, enough about Neil okay. Breen. Let's talk about this Hold movie. On, I got one more okay, question. One sure. more question. Did anyone before. ask about this, how there's never soundtracks? There's almost no music in his No, movie nobody movies. asked that. Nobody asked. God, it's now, irritating. I'm assuming that's because he finds, like, the one, you know, uh, sort of, like, royalty-free, like, Tracks. song oh, that, like, fits good. the movie. And he's like, this is the beginning and the end. That's, you know, that's where I'm going to put it. It doesn't even seem like it's in the credits, either. It, it, I don't remember. It, dude, you just get so used to not hearing it. Yeah. I don't remember. <laughs> It's insane. I always I, I do that in every one of his movies. You get like three quarters of the way through, and you're like, God damn it! There hasn't silent. been any music. It's just I can hear no, them it's, walking. Yeah, you hear that? <laughs> it's all just the soundtrack no. is just clothes like rubbing on. Like <laughs> it's irritating, man. I said to somebody the other night, uh, like talking about editing, right? And I was like, I was like, in a way, editing is all about crutches. You know, like mm-hmm. if you haven't seen because like movies aren't real, so they're fake. How do you make fake things real? And right. I was like, everything you have to worry about, what is the crutch that this can lean on to kind of make it work? Yeah. And when you have something that's just raw footage from a camcorder with no soundtrack, there's yeah. no crutch anymore. Yeah. It's just like hard, <laughs> like lifeless, soulless cuts to the next thing it's without awful. sound or anything it's just oh my god it's raw it's yeah. so fucking raw <laughs> yeah it's silent and oh god it's it just makes you feel like you're in an abyss <laughs> <laughs> maybe that's what he wants uh, i don't yeah. know yeah. i don't know it's art man it's art yeah, it's art <laughs> anyway pass through <laughs> It starts it's, with a JPEG of some shit. Like, <laughs> like someone, some, and it ends with a JPEG it ends of some with shit. A JPEG with some <laughs> shit. <laughs> it's just like vague space with a graph around yeah, it. And space you're like, sphere. What? It's like a sphere of gra- It's like a graphic sphere, and then it has yeah, space. Yeah, like spacey things right. in it. It. It's what I think he thinks. It's what he sees when he looks at other people. <laughs> he just sees us all as just like shapes, gyrating shapes and spheres. Uh. <laughs> uh, and th- okay, just this is gonna be really hard to do. Yeah. yeah. Well, it, this that's, what we're, that's what we were saying before we started like doing this. Was just like, how the fuck do we talk about this movie? Like, no, I don't even so know what the little dialogue. I don't even know so what the plot was. Anything. <laughs> Like I like I, just, and not, I don't, don't really. it's not like you're saying that to be a cynical right, person. No. Like I don't know. It's like it's like K-Pax with where nothing happens. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's a really good scenario. It's actually. K-Pax with no budget and an insane yeah. person making it. Yeah, yeah, really. What happens first, though? The well, junkie. There's a, a junkie? there's like a oh. wide shot of the desert, and isn't it? Oh yeah, there's I, drones. There's one wide shot of the desert. Like, well, the whole opens, movie. There's, is just, isn't there like a we're call it what we're gonna call oh, the, the dot. dot. Oh, yeah, the dot. Isn't the dot show up in the sky or something? Yeah, it's a shot of some mountains and it says "pass through" and then <laughs> in red, which it, is different than all the other titles, right? Because they're white. And then this like <laughs> this like red dot appears on the screen for like a second, and yeah. then it cuts to another thing, and the. <sighs> 
I mean, should we even talk well, about it the kinda dot? Starts, like, it kind of starts off like 2001 Space Odyssey, where there's like a... Well, yeah, it goes to the shot of the yeah. rocks with the cave yeah. paintings that are all sidewalk chalk. Oh, yeah, God, right. that's right. That have just like, symbols that we could never even describe. Yeah. It doesn't matter. Yeah. Just, circles, just a bunch of squiggles, and then there's like a hand uh, print. Just, oh, a yeah, humanoid, yeah. like... Fuzzy. It's got like patches of hair glued to it. Yeah, it, and, yeah. it looks like a monster <laughs> hand. <laughs> yeah, not yeah. like an ape hand right, at yeah. all. Yeah. Starts like drawing on it. <laughs> it looks like somebody put like Vaseline on their arm and then just like rub their arm <laughs> on the floor of a barber shop. It looks. <laughs> Yeah, it's very patchy. Or it's yeah. like the guy at the end of RoboCop who gets melted. Yeah, yeah, yeah. his yeah. arm is like. <laughs> yeah. So it, it's like that. It's like a monster ape arm drawing yeah. on a cave, but you don't see the. It's actual not a cave. Thing. It's just some. It's rocks. just some rocks. You're right. It's yeah. just like rocks. It's from... They're just rocks, not a cave. Sorry, I, we didn't get to the cave yet. Yeah, God, right. the cave. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, whatever. And so. <laughs> He's painting things, then this, like, shadow rolls across him. Yeah. And then we see the dot again, right? Uh, yeah, I believe so. And then there's a... Because <laughs> we were like, wait, so the monkey thing... You could thing, say that the... sentence 900 times. The <laughs> mist shadow turned the monkey man, a presumed monkey man, the, 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 the hair arm person, <laughs> into a red dot. Yeah. Which then was in the sky again. Oh, we forgot about the. Uh, and then it comes well, to the, the the caveman the, clocks though too. It pans. Oh yeah, from, it, it shows, pans from the oh, guy. Right. It shows three kitchen clocks, clocks at different times. They were bought from IKEA. Yeah. yeah <laughs> oh, and there's also a tiger there's a chilling tiger. out on top of the rocks. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's like a it's like a green screened tiger <laughs> effect. Yeah. I'm guess got to be available on YouTube somewhere. Yeah, it has I'm to definitely be. It finding has to be. it. Yeah. I'm using that for something. Yeah. <laughs> It's got to be available if yeah, he's yeah. using it. You know. I need that tiger. I need that tiger. Uh, <laughs> That's when it cuts to the dot in the sky again, and then it shows... The immigrants, right? They're walking. Oh, I think the kids, the science kids, are first. Because we... Jesus I, I don't know now. <laughs> this is seriously, like, trying to put what we just saw in order in my mind is the most challenging thing I feel like I've ever done in my fucking life. <laughs> <laughs> like, for it's real. It's close uh, to impossible. No, it really is... <laughs> I think it's the science kids. Okay, fine. Kids. We'll just say it's the science kids. I'm yeah, pretty sure it sure. cuts to the... <laughs> the <it's>, science. <laughs> I don't know what else to no, call No, you're right. Them. No, it cuts to the bed, yeah. and there's, like, astronomy books and, like, the universe. And there's there's the right. posters. Oh, it's, the, it's like you typed in space books on Amazon and just ordered the first, the first five. Th- yeah. <laughs> <You know? laughs> yeah. Yeah. And they're on a bed, and it pans over. There's it's a, a room filled with space the kid posters. Has, yeah, space posters, and the kid has, like, two monitors. And I... And it's Neil Breen, so nothing's on. Right? Right, These yeah. are off computers, yeah. and they're the kid. And it's like this kid, and he goes, "It's happening again. I'm tracking it." And we're like, "What the fuck is happening?" Yeah, I uh, want to know too that the, we say space posters, and it's not yeah. like it's like pictures it's like of space. <laughs> yeah, and like no words or anything. It's yeah. just NASA took photos, and I printed them out. Yeah, and they're on my wall. That's yeah. what we're talking about. Yeah. Yeah. I think then you get a flash of the old man in the bed with yeah. the computer. Who also has, all had the same space, space posters. posters. But it looked like someone with dementia hung them up on his wall. <laughs> like they're all just fucking pointing different directions and like nothing straight at all. Uh, and he says something like, no, I don't uh, think he says anything. He doesn't say anything time. this time. I think it just. Sh- There's so much stuff where he's just showing you things where no one talks. Yeah. I think you just yeah. see him laying in the bed with a computer going, like, looking at it. Yeah. He's not much for, like, a, a scene building. Yeah, no. no. He loved the man that cut, but this movie is, like, uh, I want to say it's, like, a Guy Ritchie movie. You know in a Guy Ritchie movie at the end when it's cutting between, like, four scenes happening at yeah. once? That's this entire movie. Yeah. The that's whole wh- movie. That's why it's so baffling. Like, yeah. I mean, <laughs> yeah, it's really, yeah. like... I think that he thought that he was doing something like that. Art, like artsy. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah I think yeah. that he thought that like by making it sort of harder to follow, he was making it more complex, which was making it smarter. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, I think that in his mind, like he was like, no, you're not supposed to get it. But oh, if- maybe he's just never watched like a movie like Memento, but he read about it. He's yeah, like, okay, right, right. so they showed stuff in the reverse order, and that's it. He read yeah. about but he doesn't it, understand to make like his movie like it, but yeah. never rented it or anything. No, he yeah. didn't watch it. He's just like, oh, they showed the scenes out of order, so I'll, okay, do, I'll that. do that. Yeah, that seems right. like a good idea. Right. Like, no, but they they also wrote it so that the scenes being showed. <laughs> nah, forget it. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like he didn't understand that portion of whatever he read. He just read <laughs> like, they okay. showed the scenes out of order, and he yes, yeah, okay, one sentence. <laughs> whole thing ruined 
then it shows uh, okay it's space kids then it yeah. shows the immigrants, the immigrants yeah. who are just a bunch of people that right different nationalities walking through the desert with backpacks and water jugs yeah, yeah. lots of water jugs right yeah. it's just really a shot of them it's, walking yeah, it's just yeah. all these people walking that's and then then there's a shot of neil bream in all denim yeah <laughs> Oh. It's looking fucking sick. <laughs> yeah. Looking real fucking sick, man. Just like he's Alex. so cool. Like, yeah. He's he's just picking up garbage. We watch him pick up garbage off the ground and put it in a bag for yeah. like a Literally minute. my favorite part of the whole movie. Yeah. My favorite part was when he was throwing the garbage out. Right. Yeah. That's good too. <laughs> but yeah, it's he's next to like a tra- like a ni- an old rusted out trailer, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And he's just picking putting garbage in a bag. Yeah. And we're like, what the fuck is happening? Yeah. But isn't that then, when it like hard cuts to him inside of the trailer, then back to him yeah, laying yeah. outside? So like yes. it cuts to him Dude. and he's like he lays down and like goes to sleep. In the trailer. In the trailer. And then it cuts I think it cuts back to like the immigrants like <laughs> wandering around and then it cuts Oh, it's because well, no, they have to get through the through, fence. They're oh. walking through those grooves in the yeah. earth yeah, thing. Right. right in the desert yeah and then it cuts back to him and he's laying on the ground now. but it was a cut from the bed yeah to him on the ground wide was him on the outside of the ground surrounded by soup cans yeah and, and with then a, a gun was a tomato person puree no no before <laughs> there's a point good good the Lord. immigrants there's I, there I'm, all, are, I know, I'm, I know. All, I'm already exhausted <laughs> like I know, I know. yeah there is a point when the immigrants go from just people walking to people being forced to walk by people with guns, right? Yeah, yeah. The like, first I shot think they knock just... over that fence. There's a scene of them like pounding on a fence until it falls over. Yeah, and then from that point on, there are they have people with guns, guns on telling them, them to move because yeah. they're escaping a country. We don't yeah. actually know this is America. Yeah, or they never say if it Mexico is. or anything. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I liked at one point that Matt assumed that the big twist was going to be that. Everyone, Everyone was leaving, leaving the awful country, and it turned out America was the awful country. Yeah, so corrupt. You that, gave it way too much credit. I, I think that that was supposed to be the case, though. Like, I honestly do. <laughs> but it's not said. I know. No, it's not. It's implied. It's well, hard. We'll it's there, hard. You have to analyze it in there. order I... to get the meaning. It's hard. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> it is making us think. Yeah. 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 Uh, so that cuts back to him. Yeah. In the bed. It's a close up of his face on the yeah. mattress. I remember. Yeah, yeah. Because then it cuts to a wide of him outside. Yeah. Also asleep. Also asleep, asleep. surrounded by the soup cans. Yeah. And then a guy it's with tomato a... puree, Bob. It's whatever. not soup. Whatever it is. And then if there was some soup, it was some soup. <laughs> and then a gun. You couldn't see half the people's heads in this right. movie. They were just no. cut off. Yeah. <laughs> he says, clean it up. So that the border patrol doesn't yeah. know that we've been here, <laughs> and uh, we'll here's your payment, and then he throws Neil Green some drugs. Hair, yeah. yeah, but like the thing that's the funniest <laughs> part about that is like, what the fuck are these like? I guess they're like narcos or something like that. Like, what are they doing? Like hanging out, eating soup or tomato paste in the middle of the <laughs> desert and just throwing it fucking everywhere, so that like the the border patrol doesn't know that but they're there. They- what? Who? I just don't know who they what, were. Wait, is the guy like, with the gun was he near where the immigrants were? He was leading them. He was one of the guys forcing them to walk with a gun. But Neil Breen's like trailer thing was near the fence place. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> right. I, what am I supposed to call it? Yes. I don't know. It was near the fenced area. <laughs> yes, I believe so. Yeah. Or not. Who knows? It could have been 200 fucking miles away. <laughs> oh, no, there was no, yeah. like... Well, the girls later are trying to prove that they're close Yeah, all right, all right. Yeah, but they we'll also... Get there, have we'll, to... get there, we'll get there, we'll get there. Okay. We'll get there. <laughs> he, so he starts cleaning up trash immediately in front of In them. front of the guy with the gun. Yeah. And then what, what He is gives that? him the Yeah, he drugs. gives him the drugs. He, it shows him clean up more, and then it shows him use the drugs. And then... It's which him was him just squirting it on his arm. arm. You could see the drippage down. Yeah, just like... Nothing made it in his bloodstream. Yeah. Yeah, and, why, then, why and then he dies. He just, <laughs> yeah, he just dies. And then he drops dead because he gets the overdosed. Dot, the dot shows up. Yep. And then the spirit him gets back up. Well, the dot while the dead the one dot, is still there. Did the dot go into him. Yeah, the dot. The goes dot goes in. into him, mm, and then Jesus, he comes back to life. But his but and then our, our right, movie like a begins. Second him stands up. A second up him stands while, up. Right. Well, well that, that was, version of him stayed on the ground. That's why <laughs> that that was. Hey guys, we spent a lot of this movie thinking there were two Neil Brains. Yeah, no, there's like, just one. I thought there was. There was just one. There was two because it's art. Mm. There was two <laughs> because it's well, art. No, like the one where him standing up. That was the art part of it. art part of it. Yeah, yeah. So what happened here is that the dot. The dot is the otherworldly presence, and it 
it went into an immigrant who died from an overdose. Yes. Which yeah. was no, he was he an immigrant? Or he was just hey, he was, why, he was, why, he, why was he, he just a piece of white well, trash? Wait a minute, wait a minute, because he constantly desert. says he's like a being from you know an right. advanced species. Yeah. I took it as that when he before that he was just an immigrant and the dot inhabited his body after he had died. Yeah. Right? Yeah, yeah. That's what happened, right? Yes. Yeah. So the dot was using... Yeah. Is that not what yeah. you... No, okay. Yeah, no, the, no, yeah. The dot yeah. was using the dead junkie's body. <laughs> you look awful. Your face is like... <laughs> I mean, it's melting. It's terrible. terrible. Yeah, melting, yeah. I don't know what's... Uh, the... Yeah. No, yeah. yeah. Yes. It yeah. took over his body. That's why when everybody was like, why... What's that stuff on your face? And he's like, oh, I must have slept Dude, in what the... was... Th- yeah. That was, was his it... body degrading. That was the body he was in, like, dying. I think. Was it? I think that's what that's supposed to be. That was just, I mean, decay? I'm analyzing it, Jimmy. <laughs> I think. No, I think so too. I thought that he just had. Yeah. Ant, I just said I thought he had ants crawling over his face the entire movie. Uh, I thought he no, just. I thought he, he sat in the dirt for a shot and didn't clean off his face for half a day. <laughs> he just didn't understand bathing because he's light. All right. Yeah. I get that. Was that supposed to be in decay? Uh, I think his body was falling apart, and he was just trying to poo-poo it. You know, well, but like, then, oh, don't worry about yeah, it. right. When the girl asked him, and yeah, yeah. that's huh. way farther. Though. I know, but I, yeah, yeah, right. even I remotely think there. that's what's up with the body situation. It was like literally, it would have been inhabiting if, a if dead we just saw body. This, if we saw the still lying there body like disappear, every god, it would have cleared up so many. Yeah, yeah. Because <laughs> the whole movie, I always thought that there, yeah, there was like the spirit brain, right, and, and the then body the brain. and the body. <laughs> the, the, the real the real brain the real brain yeah <laughs> the holy divinity is the body yeah. brain there's and three the brains brain. god damn it <laughs> okay so now he's super jesus techno jesus from another civilization yeah inhabited by the dot right yes and then so <laughs> we the, go back to the immigrants yeah and like the cartel members start shooting them well, yeah. Dude, <laughs> i love this like it, or, <laughs> It's the old woman. It's an old woman holding a young child, and there's this black woman standing in front of her with a gun. And she goes, the fucking best line of the whole movie. She goes, You two don't have any value to me on the streets. And then she shoots the old woman. And then the boy goes, Why? Why would you do that? And then she goes, Because you have no value to me. On the street, and she, boom, shoots him. And I was like, "This character's awesome." <laughs> yeah, that was that was my favorite character in the movie. She fucking rocked. She, she was great. She was so good. Like literally, maybe the best performance in a Neil Breen movie. Yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Oh, absolutely. The most passion I've ever seen. Absolutely. Yeah, I don't, even, I don't even think she was acting. I think that's just how she is in real life. <laughs> she was amazing. Um, and there was also like another. So she murders there, them. And the guy was holding a gun against a bunch of women, right? Well, that yeah, and they they. That there's these two girls uh, make a break for it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the oh, wait, guy holds for- up his gun and goes, bang, 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 and misses, though. Yeah. Well, well we, we don't forgot, see that. We, we forgot one thing, too. When, they, when, they, when the immigrants <laughs> first... Sure? N- yes, no. Uh, <laughs> I, I distinctly remember this. When they first... <laughs> We're going to forget so much. It's a fever dream. I, it doesn't matter. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Uh, when they first show up, though, and then they bang on the fence with their hands lightly until the fence falls down. <laughs> right. Uh, yeah. And then they cross over the fence and then immediately there is a shot of that black lady who yells at everybody uh, holding a knife to a pregnant lady. Oh, fuck. Uh, I forgot and she's about like, that. God, she's like, it. how many, how many months pregnant are you? <laughs> and like, then the lady, seven, seven. And then the, the lady goes, Oh yeah. And then stabs her in the stomach. And we thought that like, she was going to kill the baby. A yeah. woman's baby. Uh, <laughs> and then she cuts the lady's shirt open. And then all these, all, dr- all all just like packets of cocaine out. come out oh, man. and then it cuts to another shot of, oh my god of a guy doing that to a man who has like cocaine in his belly <laughs> as if he's trying to cross pregnant too and then they cut it open then it falls out this is a, this is something that happens a lot in the movie is that whatever happens to the uh group of uh women immigrants has to, oh. yeah. happens like shot for shot, shot and line for line, line, man, to the male immigrants as well, just in a different shot. Well, he but wants equal. Also, he wants it to be equality right, with yeah. his movies. Well, yeah, he doesn't yeah. want to seem like a sex. Men can right. be pregnant in his movies. Right. Yeah, of I mean, he only fucked a teenager in his third movie. Or so, Jesus I, God, I, you're maybe right, he's he just trying to fix that problem. Yeah. Um, but, uh, and then there's that. Whole, on, it's, yeah, the shot of it's just a bunch of dudes with guns crotches down yeah. like that's all you're looking at is their crotches oh man and all the, the drugs. dissemination of the drugs yeah and, and they're like, like this, this is ceos yeah this, this is this pack of drugs is for the ceos the this, media yeah <laughs> it's 
like, like whoa, what? Like, what the, the fuck? I, my favorite was this is for the bankers, and then three later it was like this is a bigger one. It's like this is for the international bankers. <laughs> <laughs> what are you That's talking there, about? There's more of them. It's international, so they get more. <laughs> It makes sense. I like how he lo- he just be so vague. He loves lists. Yeah, of and he loves he vagueness. Hates. There's no. But it, it's not vague. It, it would be vague if there was any implication whatsoever. <laughs> <laughs> like it, it's not vague. He's, He's just certain, every movie. Lists. Every movie like that I've seen of his has ended with him just being like politicians are bad. <laughs> we gotta kill all the corrupt politicians. Just looking straight into the camera, like at you as the viewer, where he's just talking to you. <laughs> I mean, you could argue, sort of, in a way, he's really punk. <laughs> he's, I mean, he's like totally about anarchy. Yeah, he hates all authority. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he's, so that's why I think he just stands in the desert all day because like it's what he loves. Yeah. He just wants everything to be gone so he can be, exist yeah. like that. It's just him in a fucking him wasteland, so tired, yeah. wearing socks. staring at staring at a drone <laughs> flying. <above. laughs> yeah, right. So okay, uh, so a bunch of women are in front of one of the like cartel. Yeah, <laughs> they run away. He shoots at him. They apparently miss. Yeah, right. and then it's a shot of them shoving men into the bag of a truck. Yeah. And, and the, the guy is like, let us out, let us out. But there's a whole door just open. Yeah, right. Only half of the thing's closed and he's only <laughs> pounding on the door that's closed. You say not... pounding. I, I, well, would, okay. I would say, I would say touching. gently smacking the door. <laughs> <laughs> a violent caress. Yeah. Yeah, 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 there you go. Yeah, yeah. That's definitely what it was. And then they eventually, like the guys that are the cartel people are like unhealthy. They're like fat <laughs> old people. They're yeah. like, yeah, we'll just close this door. Yeah. It looks like they don't even want to be alive. Yeah. You know? <laughs> And then, uh, and then after that, they cut to a scene. And see, this is where I was confused. They cut to a scene this of me. yeah, right. This is the only time I was confused <laughs> yeah, yeah, in this yeah. entire fucking movie. Yeah. Uh, but like, they uh, cut to a scene of again, like the same scene, mm-hmm. the same truck, but they're putting women in. And the last two women are the women that ran away. Like, yes, I was really confused that by shot. that. The, the two women but that ran wasn't away. Wasn't after we see the 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 exposition scene in the field? No, because I remember. No, like, it wasn't. Really? Because I remember thinking, wait yeah, a minute. It loads yeah. them in the truck. It loads the men in the, the truck. truck. Yeah. Then we get the shot. The, the field, awesome the shot. Field, the field yeah. shot. With like, the right. greatest person ever. <laughs> the two women run to the field, fall to their knees, and one of them grabs the other and goes, Your mother was my sister! <laughs> And I promised her I'll save you because you're my niece. <laughs> we have to go. And we were like, oh, no. Yeah. I know. It's great because it's like a wide shot, but she's screaming at someone that's like, a, right in like, front of her. like two right. inches from her yeah. face. She's not looking at her either. I, th- that yeah, woman like, delivered yeah. most of her lines staring straight forward, whatever way she was facing. Yeah. Fuck yeah. anybody was around her or she was supposed to be looking at something. She was just staring straight forward and screaming all yeah. of her lines. The exposition to <laughs> to tell who those the relationship between those two was so harsh. Yeah. <laughs> it happened at three times. Yeah. 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 You were my niece. <laughs> Then uh, it cuts and back that, to yeah. what you were saying. And then it cuts to them. Uh, yeah. And they shoved sh- into a truck. And, 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 they're and it, literally, shows, it shows them getting shoved yeah, into a truck. Yeah, they didn't change their shirts. They didn't do anything like that. No, it's just them. It's just them in the clothing that they were wearing. And so I was like, oh, did they get caught? Or did they, like, get saved? Like, <laughs> I don't know what the just, fuck's happening He doesn't here. know how to make a movie. It's continent. Yeah. He did not check for continuity yeah. problems. He was like, all right, everybody's here. Can load all the women that I have available in What did truck? I tell you at the beginning of this podcast? He looks at human beings. He just sees, like, shapes. Yeah. Like, all right, I need nine <laughs> orbs to get in the back of this box. <laughs> Neil Bridges just sees people. He sees your soul. He yeah. like, glasses. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what this stuff looks like because he's just almost blind. <laughs> Dude, nine of you, nine of you blobs get in that box. Sir, no, nice, any of you. I'm the director. Do what I'm saying. <laughs> like, okay. <laughs> it's because he stares at the sun all the time. I'm right. I'm right. You can't see he shit. burned out his retinas yeah, a long yeah. time ago. It's just blobs. <laughs> and that's all he gets. All right, what happens Ooh. after that again? <laughs> Fuck, dude, I just um, say I can't. That's when he starts wandering as oh yeah, he body he wanders over to this wall man. that you see a million times. This like oh. rock wall that he just disappears into. He and touches it. He touches it, and then he disappears into it. And then there's a bunch of shots. You say that like uh, it's like this amazing effect. <laughs> oh no, he it's, it's not. Into it. No. it fades him he out. Fades yeah, out. Yeah, and yeah. then and then he's at the, the rock wall the again. Rock wall. Yeah. 
and, then, and the and, tiger's there, and he touches the wall, and he hangs out with the tiger some dude, more. Dude, well, I feel like, honestly, I feel like after what, this point... What am I after, missing, no, 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 Bob? After this point in the movie where we were just talking, it becomes nearly impossible to break it down scene by scene, it is. I would say. Like, it's, 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 it's possible. It, 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 because then yeah, it's, it's just impossible. like, it's all the same shit happening over and over again. Tons of drone like, footage lots of him of, sitting like, on rocks. He obviously, yeah, he got himself some a fucking drone. <laughs> found a drone yeah. and got Neil Breen. Like, they, they probably told him what it does. Yeah. Can you imagine that moment in his mind when somebody explained oh. what a drone is to yeah. him? And he was like, what? Yeah. What? <laughs> He's like, so well, you, you can look at me from the vantage of God? <laughs> <laughs> and then they were Allow me to completely misuse it with scenes with circular rocks that I don't use it on. Yeah. yeah. There was no drone footage of that rock stuff. Or there was, there but was, it was like it was at like eye from level. The side. It was, it was at like the eye side. level. <laughs> there was not a single shot it. of him with the circle looking uh. yeah but yeah i, I feel like like this is it, it really 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 like just kind of devolved i felt like like it just into sort of like a lot of padding scenes of him sitting on rocks with like drones <laughs> uh like you know filming it um, and there's always some kind with the drone footage there's always like a soliloquy yeah about right humanity yeah. not using its resources right. or, or there was stuff where it was like the only way for you to understand me is for me to be inside of you and for us to be the same yeah and you're right. like okay yeah a human okay. is on the inside as they are are on the outside as we all are like you said he, on the you were inside. like is he the guy from mystery yes. man like he's, yeah, the, same yeah. thing. he's the sphinx <laughs> <laughs> well that's the shot here is he is he's at the painting wall and then it the lion's like it's what, a tiger what? it's tiger. the tiger's 20 feet above him and then it's this weird shot of both of them together, both of them together like side by side side by side green screen faces yeah and then it cuts to him walking away yeah and then it's like a drone shot. <laughs> Dude, yeah. I think the podcast's over, man. Yeah, just right. the then, movie. Yeah, then, <laughs> you know, we see the Then you'll the bring girls. sells the house. No, there's other stuff. We I get, know. We yeah, see the yeah. girls well, the, who escaped, like, trying to survive. When the, it's just well, a shot of the girl the tw- the two alone. Girls. Yeah, the, yeah. Uh, the, the niece, is, and she just goes, I can't sleep outside. We've got to find somewhere to sleep in a shelter. Just, like, staring above the camera to yeah. no one. And then it and then it's that like hard hard shot. cut to them at Neil Breen's like Hobo trailer is like trailer and him yeah. insisting that they stay there oh, yes. and then they're like we can't stay here this is insane it's we can't stay dirty. here it's dirty and then he was like I no, will clean it now yeah <laughs> and the, you watch him clean it the cleaning scene the cleaning scene <laughs> that's my favorite part it's like you literally just, my favorite part of the entire you movie. just watch him clean it yeah. But for like, like a way too long. But when, when you say I watch him it. clean it, I, I worry that people who haven't seen this movie have this vision in of their head of him and, scrubbing oh, yeah, and yeah, sweeping. Yeah. No, he kneels down and like gets on all fours on a mattress <laughs> and then grabs all the fucking cans of tomato paste and like empty milk jugs and just throws and yogurt, them. And, and yogurt, yogurt. And yogurt. And yogurt. Yeah, yes. that's a key plot Very point. Very important. Key here. plot point. <laughs> yeah. Let's uh, not forget. And then just throws them out the fucking door of the While trailer. While smiling. Like it's like... Like he's like it's, it's like comedy. the spinach scene in Fable Findings. Yeah. In his mind, he That's, thinks it's like cute. Yeah. Yep. Right. And he's like, and it shows the girl outside, and she's just going, <coughs> "Oh, oh God, what? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> yeah. It was amazing. She's the best actress, man. <laughs> yeah. Just screams every line. Screaming. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> and oh, man. Then <clears throat> I. Well, then it cuts like to them huddled in the corner. Yeah, they're, like, they're, yeah. they're not in even the like enjoying the clean space he <laughs> right. made. They're like huddled in the corner, yeah. like, what's like he's about to attack them. It's ungrateful, insane. ungrateful, it's terrible. Ungrateful. And he's like, he spent a lot of time cleaning, and they just couldn't. He <laughs> says he's gonna. <laughs> You can stand up straight. Like, you don't have to... I'm pretty sure this trailer was just in the desert, too. Oh, yeah, probably. Like, he found it. Yeah. He probably found those girls in there and then cast them in the movie. <laughs> you like... want to be in a movie? <laughs> they scene, were doing hair when I... scream things? Okay. <laughs> mm. I'll um... give you some tomato puree. <laughs> okay, then... Oh, then we get another shot of more people getting loaded into a different... In a bus this time. Yep. Right, right. More yeah. immigrants because I said into I was like, bus. didn't they already load these people up? Yeah. But then they reloaded them into a, a bus. bus. I have yeah. a feeling. I have a feeling that the scene with them loading them up in the truck 
was probably from the beginning of the movie, just a- edited in later, yeah. which is why you no, saw the two right. girls. Mm-hmm. Uh, like, I have a feeling that, and that... It's, the, it's the men, too. Yeah. He's they, loading... the, only the men go in the bus because that's when all the women go to the, the whatever, the, the model house. home. The, right. model the, home. The, the home somewhere. They all get shoved into this room, and that's when the, the black lady who killed the people <laughs> earlier comes back and just goes, you're mine now! <laughs> I own you. It's so good. And yeah. she just screams yeah. at him. She's like, you tried to escape, and now you're mine! <laughs> and, like, and then it just cuts to something else. I love, like, too, that they, she doesn't do anything with it. They're no. just like, I own you, and you just sit in this room. I'm going to pack it. you into a room like sardines and just make you wait out until you kill yourself. Yeah. Like, what the fuck? Yeah. Are you, are you profiting from this? Yeah. I don't, and that's what like, was the end goal? Like, I thought that, yeah, because like the whole thing too. Wh- so were these, I don't even know who the immigrant people were. Were they, were they drug? Well, Jimmy, there's like an exposition scene where they talk about their country. Oh yeah. No, 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 everyone. no. I know that. Yet, I know that. But, but like, but like, were they drug mules? Like why did they like have like know. a pregnant lady full of cocaine? <laughs> And like I didn't know if they were like drug mules that were or like were they go- fleeing because of tyranny and oppression yeah, and corruption. And then, but then they're just but they're also but they were like also- wait 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 one of the most important things I need to bring with me is a pregnant belly's worth of cocaine. <laughs> That well, there was the one already guy assigned to a bunch of like CEOs yeah, so, and, like, and politicians. I don't know if they were like. But there was the one guy when they're doing all the like the testimonials. The one guy goes like, "I know what I do is wrong." But I have to do it. Yeah. <laughs> so maybe, I don't know. He had to run drugs. I don't know. That's who how are the, fucked everything is. Uh, who are the cartel people, though? Are, I don't know. Who are any people? <laughs> I don't know. Like, honestly. Like, I mean, I realize there's no actual answer to that question. Yeah. I don't know. But, like, these people are being held hostage, and I don't know who they are or who the people holding the it's like It's are. like Neil Breen knows that hostages <laughs> are a something. thing. He knows that hostages are a thing, but doesn't understand that there's, like, a reason for people taking hostages. Like, he thinks that hostage situations <laughs> just They're evil, so they just take hostages. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Nor does he understand, like, immigration. Right. At all. He yeah. doesn't understand what an immigrant is. Yeah. Like, you know what I mean? Like, he thinks, like, other people are forcing immigrants across the border yeah all the time yeah, I, dude i have no idea you, what that yeah. means i so don't understand the, yeah. wh- how they're like what they're doing with these people and why yeah, i don't they either keep them in a fucking they, house yeah, they just keep they keep all the bus, la- they keep all the ladies in a room they keep all the guys in a bus who's making money where i don't know one of the girls i guess the conditions the conditions of like sleeping in the same room with like 10 other girls was so bad that she hung herself in the shower which they get shower breaks by the way like the, yeah, yeah, the, yeah. these like two, like awful they're in, like, like an empty house why not though yeah but it's, a, it's obviously like from his yeah, job they're in an empty house why don't they keep like some of the girls in other rooms then like it's there's why? probably more than one room yeah uh, there's a reason every neil Breen movie has just houses that have nothing on the walls yeah. it's because they're model homes yeah I, I didn't i don't know why that didn't connect yeah the real estate thing didn't connect with me until this movie yeah i was like oh of course he has all these sets just <laughs> homes that no one's lived yeah in las vegas yeah <laughs> yeah like the pool scenes in this movie yeah it's yeah, yeah. like yeah, yeah. i'm selling oh, this place i can by the way hang out in the pool for one thing hours. that uh speaking of neil breen's like you know real life uh one thing that he talked about that i that blew my fucking mind uh he pays all of his actors like sag rates uh is what he said like he pays his actors That's awesome like actual money to be in his movies they're not volunteers or anything like, like the that. woman that screamed every line got yes. paid yeah she got That's... paid like <laughs> like <laughs> That's awesome, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, it's I and again, it. I think that that like goes to show that like he he there's he views like, it as real. He views it as real, yeah. but I think that there's also like the veneer is what he likes about it more than anything. Like I think that like you know like I was just saying like hostages being in a hostage situation because they're hostages and like that kind of shit. Like I think that it's just something where he likes the sort of like look of it and he likes the to be able to say like you know I pay my actors like screen actors you know guild yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, rates and all that kind of stuff because that legitimizes it for him. Mm-hmm. It will also kind of number like you said it makes him seem like a producer. Yeah. Right. Like, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Like, you like saying, I'm a filmmaker. Yeah. I do this. I did that. We right. shot a hostage scene today. Yeah. It doesn't matter what the content of the hostage scene is. It's right. just that he, he did. did it. Yeah. Right. It doesn't know, matter like, that he can make say no it to, in a sentence as someone at a cocktail party. Yeah. Now. Totally. Because he right. did it. Totally. I've made four feature length films. Legitimate. Le- yeah. He, in those, legitimate. In those, he does. He keeps saying the two, word legitimate. In those videos we watched, he yeah. said legitimate so many times. Yeah. Right. And it makes me wonder what is not legitimate. Yeah. 
You right, know, right. we have friends who have made movies. Well, but like he that said, he, no he doesn't want people to think them. it's a shit movie, and that he doesn't, and he doesn't care. Right. right. Well, right. I don't. But that's the other thing too. He's is, protecting himself. By he also like, no, doesn't watch paid, other movies. Yeah. I hired real actors, paid them real actor yeah. money. I did all. You know, I, I did also, all the things. It's a real movie, and I like a real estate agent. It's all about bureaucracy. Yeah. The paperwork is there to prove that it's real. Yeah. If you say it's not, yeah. you're fucking, you're wrong. Right, man. yeah. <laughs> well, I also, like, I don't think that he doesn't, like, give a shit. Like, I think that he really does give a shit. But I think that, like... You wouldn't make five movies yeah, to have yeah, a yeah. message no, I think, I think that, he, that I think that he loves doing this. And I think that, like, you know, he... he it seems like he, he does want to sort of, like, promote a message or something like that. Um, but I think that, like, he, like, counterbalances the sort of, like, you know like parts of the movie that are just like genuinely legitimately not good with those sort of like, you know, things where he's like, Oh, I'm going to, you know, have two name actors in my next movie, uh, <laughs> which I'm very excited about, by the way. Yeah. Or like, Oh, you know, I, um, you know, I'm paying this I'm, much. It's and... going to be like sitcom actors or something. Oh. It's yeah. like, would, like all washed would... up sitcom actors. I can't wait. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Obviously, but... I would Ray Romano. Just start looking up who <laughs> that would be in great. Vegas. That would be Screech insane. and Ray, Ray Romano, Romano in Twisted by Neil Breen. <laughs> I mean, all right. Get yeah. fucking I mean, I'm weird, already man. watching it. Who cares? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's like I'm not gonna see it. Yeah, yeah. It doesn't um, matter. But no, I mean, like, yeah, I, I think that he, lo- I think that he loves making these movies. I think that, and I think that he, he legitimately like views them as bigger than they actually are. You know, because uh, again, you wouldn't. Make- well, there's kind of like there's kind of like uh, blindness. To yeah. your own. like you know how like you can't see you can't like smell your own farts <laughs> or some people can't i mean i can i can <laughs> but some people I, there's legitimately some people cannot smell their own fucking stink you yeah, know what right, i mean and right. the, like he, he probably watches it and he doesn't see much wrong with it mm-hmm. you know that's it yeah i've definitely have i've seen people online and other filmmakers where i'm like do you know what this you know yeah. he, mm-hmm. he's just got a case that's egregious yeah on every level, but yeah. he's also got the drive. Oh yeah, <laughs> to yeah. Get you know, yeah. It doesn't get matter it what you there. do as it's long great. as you keep doing it. Yeah, and he's not gonna fucking stop. Yeah, no one's yeah. gonna stop him. He's very inspirational. <laughs> Where are we? Um, so what uh, are we just talking about? The oh, room. Uh, yeah, the, the, the testimonial thing uh, I think yeah. happens then because it's yeah. like, like into a, it shows uh, the women in the room and the one woman apropos of nothing just goes like, "I left my terrible country." To find a new life for me and my family. And then yeah. they all just start saying stuff. And then everybody, and then, everybody's <laughs> saying, like, I hate the politicians. They killed my The so one woman so. says, the government killed my husband. Yeah. yeah. No qualifiers. Yeah. No, the that's, government I, killed yeah. my husband. Okay. Over yeah. something by accident. Who? Right. Who was your what, husband? What, what did yeah. you branch of the government yeah. Yeah. killed him? <laughs> Under what? So was he banned in a public square, <laughs> or sure, like was he black bagged and shot? Like, what what happened? are you? You're yeah. allowed to talk about it. Yeah. Like, yeah. No. And then so like, but yeah, this is insane. But you okay. can't just say that. Yeah. It's well, and that, but that's what everybody says. Like, I know. It's, they, it's awesome. Like, <laughs> it's just Neil Breen's. Like, he's just like you, you get it. Yeah, everything about him is just like you get it. Now look at my art. No, yeah. Details do not matter. You know, yeah. no, 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 it's a don't. fucking bank. It doesn't matter what the name is. Yeah, it's, a, it's the media. I don't need to say anything else. It's yeah. a multi. Uh, we'll get to the media. <laughs> yeah. and, 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 and then and then they cut to uh, a scene where. <laughs> It's literally the same dialogue, just the guys are saying. The guys, yep. yeah. yeah. And instead of like, yeah, instead of her husband, it was it, like, it, it killed my wife, bear, or my wife, or my. Did yeah. you say my bear? <laughs> my bear. I was about to say parents. Oh. <laughs> my son. It killed my bear. The government killed my bear. I wish that I wish you put details in, like you know, like the town alderman pushed my wife <laughs> into a blender. <laughs> like, yeah. It's just like really weird shit. Whoa. <laughs> Why do you want to get the fuck out of here? The state, the state comptroller lined my children up and shot them execution style. <laughs> oh, man. I love it. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> so specific. With no reason why. Yeah. Why would that happen? God damn it. Uh, they, so that happens. Yeah. yeah a whole lot so of that. <laughs> Isn't that like not long after is when the woman hangs herself? Or uh, like, yeah, you've been in the bathroom too long. <laughs> not Get out of here. <laughs> yeah, and oh, then she opens dead. the door. This woman sees her hanging from like the shower 
You know, yeah. that, that, she, she was hanging from the thing that holds the sliding door. I know. Yeah, no, she was just standing she there. She was certainly yeah. just standing flat-footed. Like. I just saw how the woman's like, damn it! Yeah. Yeah, right. Somebody get here, help me clean this up. And a guy comes in and just like, watch picks out. He sort of picks her up and then yeah. cuts away. Yeah, yeah. Because she wasn't actually hanging. There was no yes. like reaction shot from the other women. No. No. No, no cut, the, 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 closest, the... the closest thing was that scene of them sleeping yeah. like all next to each other and then one knees the other one in the back. And I think they actually get into like a legitimate fight. argument. Like a legitimate fight. And, and Neil Breen was just rolling the camera. Yeah, he was hoping that they were going to start like, you know, having a pillow fight. Yeah. Like <laughs> oh, this might get sexy. Yeah. That's um, so awesome. Yeah, and then I love too that the thing that they were uh, like the end of the argument when they were trying to like tough talk each other, like the one girl was like, "You go to sleep first. and then the other girl was like, "No, you go to sleep first. And then the girl like laid down to go to sleep, and she was like, "That's right, <laughs> that's right bitch. You go to sleep." <laughs> That's just, that's like the most interplay between those characters that you get. Yeah, yep, totally. which is a well, yeah, the only real other things argument. They, the only yeah. other things they say is that the government killed their family. <laughs> but they weren't even saying that to each other. Yeah, they, were they were just, just screaming, they just into looking the sky. off into space, like screaming it in a circle. Like that was it. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? The story of a I just think it is out. I know we already talked about it, but a woman who can sit there and be like, "The government killed my husband," and now she's an immigrant, like. Her story is so interesting. Why yeah. are we watching it's that It's so much movie? more interesting than Space the, Dot. Was, God. Right. I'm just yeah. saying. Yeah. Like, the Dot Man What boring. happened to this woman yeah. that heard the government just kill her husband? She knows about it and became an immigrant yeah. that smuggled she, drugs. She had to flee the country. What the fuck are you doing? What is happening here? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. All right. And then there's stuff happening I, with... Neil Breen and the women. Yeah, so Neil Breen, uh, <laughs> another oh, one of my favorite the... scenes. Okay. Oh, no, I was going to say when he tells them uh, his name. Oh, uh, right, and... it's around there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so, like, his there's name is Till. Till. Uh, and then, then he spells it. <laughs> he spells it uh, T H G I L. But it's pronounced Till. Till. Till, but it's pronounced Till. And he, he had a reason for it, right? And he just goes, oh, it's a foreign name. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. Not from here. I think that, like, well, it comes up later. At <gasps> first, I thought that he just, like, came up with this really fucking dope way of spelling Till. And was like, it only says it in weird. the script and you're not going to see it yeah. like, <laughs> written out anywhere. So I got to make sure that, like, everybody knows that it's it's a cool way to spell it's it. Yeah. Till. <laughs> the glit. Yeah. <laughs> And then they show there's a close up shot of the yogurt. Well, so that happens like, like a, a few scenes later. A few scenes later. No, no, yeah. I think he sees it right there. No, no, no. Because that's I can't no. argue either way. Right. He doesn't, there's no, no way I can remember. It, it goes on for like a little while, and there's like this. And again, this is where it starts getting like even more kind of like fucked up and padded out. I feel like where like he goes. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We skipped. Oh, no shit. No, we did skip I, something really we, fucking good. Oh yeah. shit. <laughs> I was, yes. uh, wait I, I was gonna say we skipped two scenes of the science kids going to the desert to find the the yeah, star no, yeah. and they see but, neil breen well the first time they see neil breen they go eh, it's just some homeless dude let's go yeah and then the second time they see him they go hey it's that dude again let's get out of here yeah like, but then, <laughs> then, no, and then the main kid says something to neil breen remember he says like who is they ask him a no, question they, she asks a question yeah they walk over, <laughs> past him in our frame and then it cuts the close-up of him and he goes not yet. Yeah, he answers the like, question. And she what? said, have you seen anything weird or out of the ordinary? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think he... Uh, did he think it was supposed to be like a not yet? Like, he's talking to himself, but it came yeah. out like he was just saying, not yet. Not yeah. Not <laughs> yet. Not yet. Yeah, it's like somebody, like one of the crew members asked him off camera, are you done like laying in the dirt? <laughs> and like... <laughs> Are you done laying in the dirt and like you know looking yeah. homeless and disheveled? And he just stood up and was like, "Not yet." Not yet. <laughs> Lay back down. God, we haven't even talked about the cave. Do I, I don't even Have know what the, like, the cave I don't even yet? know what the significance of the cave. There's there is ever a cave. Was. What, yeah. what were you guys excited well, about? Skinny? I was that. So, oh, you were well, okay. what science I was, kids. What I was okay, excited yeah. about. Uh, so there is there's a bunch of scenes of him going and touching the wall, and then he like goes into the cave. Right, right. Hangs and out with to, the tiger every time. Yeah, and there's but there's this like cave with like shadows moving over the walls, uh, <laughs> oh, and fuck. it's supposed to wait like, till we get there though. The reveal of that. Well, is no, so, I'm, we're not, I, we'll wait. Yeah, it's good. It's very very good. Uh, <laughs> well, good. No, it's good. I I, 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 I like this this like twist at the end of the movie was just like. 
It was. It wasn't it's, even. It wasn't even a curve. It wasn't even a curve ball. It was like a curve shit. Like <laughs> yeah, you're like. Oh, I thought it was. I thought you were throwing a baseball, but now that it's all over my face, it's, a it's shit. It's, it's dog shit. <laughs> we watched Great. a lot of footage of a cave yeah. with shadows moving in it. Yeah, and we had no, we, and so much like footage, not yeah. just one. Yeah established no no, you know, no it's established like four or five as, times there's as many like shots of that cave and the shadows moving over the wall as there are neil breen sitting on top of a mountain with a uh fucking drone out, all, out, like almost out of frame yeah like, his he's, head is touching the top of yeah the no, it's, it's, it's so funny because it's, it's, it's fish eye it's like a fish eye on a drone yeah. and he's not in the middle of it so it, it seems like he's even farther I know. away like i'm pretty sure it's like one of the drones you'd buy at best buy like three years Ago. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's well, like the movie, consumer drone type it, thing. It was that finished has fish eye lens on it. It yeah. was like finished in like 2015. So right, that makes sense. So he found it in like Best yeah. Buy. It was like, oh, this does this. Yeah. Ooh. And so anyway, back to the cave. Yeah. Uh, the and cave. look, you know, I guess wherever we're at in this nightmare of a plot. <laughs> um, so uh, yeah, he goes into the cave, uh, and then the uh, niece follows him there. Uh, and she's like crouched down behind a bush and she oh, yeah. watches him go in and then <laughs> he disappears. He disappears. She falls yeah. asleep. And she like well, scratches she's... her head. She scratches her head in order to make sure that the un- audience understands that she's confused. And then she just falls asleep for no reason. And then he goes into the cave and there's like all the shadows. I think and all she was stuff. passing out, but yeah, I mean, it doesn't matter. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and then, so uh, he comes back out. She follows him and she's like, I saw you disappear into the cave. You're weird, dude. Or like something yeah, like she that. Does. She and says, you're, you're a weird dude. dude. Yeah. yeah. And yeah, then yeah. he like kind of like laughs. And then he walks back to the trailer and the uh, aunt is there and she says, get the fuck away from me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and she hits God, him in the face with a rock. And then, and then she throws a rock and hits him in the eye. And I'm pretty sure it was like a real, <laughs> a real rock. rock. Dude, it looked gnarly. Yeah. Dude, that could have been like a real thing. I heard just screaming at Neil Breen. <laughs> and he probably tried to go a little too far. Yeah. Get away from me. Yeah. Hey, you sick bastard. But then this is, this like, is uh... a, and again, this is why the movie feels so weird and out of order. This is after he cleaned up the space for them and, and like let them know he's been there there's no reason for her to be mad right now. yeah 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 like there's no reason whatsoever he went on a walk and yeah, came back yeah and like, you piece of shit yeah uh. and then so neil breen wakes up i love that we're calling him neil breen too like it's yeah, not yeah. that it's a character yeah, yeah. Like, it's, it's, it's just him. him he's in yeah. all of his movies uh <laughs> and so he like wakes up and he's got like blood on his eye or something like that and then she's like comes up and she's like no 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 oh. i'm not gonna hurt you yeah. let I'll, me like, dab it let me dab it let me let me tap the blood off your face i think it's like literally the line and she's like, just let me tell you. What's blood. weird is this is before the scene later in the trailer, mm-hmm. Jesus God, <laughs> where she says, What's that on your face? Right. She dabs the blood off his face in this whole scene. Yeah. But then later on, she says, What's that on your face? Yeah. And then he like wipes it away and he's like, Oh, it's just dirt. I slept in the ground in last the night. Ground. In the ground. <laughs> <laughs> That's because he's in a dead body. He's going like into the earth to keep yeah. cold oh. at night to keep the body preserved. That makes sense. That makes sense. You know, the joke's on us, guys. We're the ones that are getting this wrong. I... <laughs> <laughs> what? Where does the cartel story go? I don't even know where it goes nowhere. No, it, it, it kind of just goes nowhere. Uh, like it stops there. We, hold the we see that they're all like scared and like that kind of stuff. It's and like then... they break out though at one point. Well, they shoot. Well, no, he starts. Oh, oh wait a minute! No, no, no. no, no. That's oh, yeah. towards the end. She the asks, bus. That's she the asks what's the on bus. his face, and yeah. that's when he explains to her, to the aunt, yeah, that he is a being from another world, yeah, and he and then can he see all some of... cans, which is a shot in reverse, yeah, right, right. And then he basically, this is when he's like, "I am going to get rid of every evil human being yeah. on the face of the yeah. earth." Yeah, and this was. Wait, no, we missed at some point. The we guys... did, but I don't. Oh wait, I'm when just... everybody was giving their testimonials, that ended with. The guy, a shot of a guy sort of looking nervous and then going, that's it. I'm getting out of here. And before he's even fully standing up, a gun comes into frame and shoots it's him. Dead, and dead. Yeah. Dead. And then, it's like, then it cuts to another shot of guys that are like two feet away. Remember? Oh, yeah. And they're just and like they're arguing like, over a bottle of water. They're not yeah. looking they don't give a fuck. at the person who was just murdered. Yeah. Nope. Yeah. Um, so before, um, uh, bef- uh, if I remember this correctly, before they uh, start talking about where he's like an interdimensional being from another planet <laughs> and like all that kind of shit, the, what sparks that off, though, is that they're sitting around in his fucking busted ass trailer looking outside at a bunch of trash on the ground and the woman oh, sees yeah. right. the yogurt that the says light like f- light, light, and fit. Light, light and fit or light and free or something like that yogurt and then she goes oh, your name isn't Till it's light 
It's light backwards. backwards. <laughs> Literally a troll. It seems like a troll too, right? Yeah, totally. Like a total like nilbog. It's like, nilbog. Like, yeah, yeah. yeah. And so like and like but for real, the whole revelation of this movie is hinged upon the fact that she looks at fucking light and free yogurt blowing around in the fucking sand. <laughs> and then connects it that it's spelt it's still spelt backwards. <laughs> she knows who an alien is because she looked at a soccer mom's trash. <laughs> Pretty much. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, and uh, and then he d- he doesn't even like try to play coy. He's just like, "Yep, you got it. I, I am it. light. Yeah, I am light." <laughs> but no one was named. Yeah, no one was named Crad. <laughs> I wish I somebody just, was named that would have been amazing. If there was but like, what, if there what was an, does that mean if, he is then? Well, yeah, he's an interdimensional super being. He's made of light. Race. Is he just light? He's made of a, a dot. Yeah, he's mm. a dot. He's a sky he dot. also touches. On a cave painting. Yeah. All right. <laughs> yeah. The dot is in him, but it's also everywhere in all these shots. Right. And he touches it a lot. He touches it. He touches it's... it, and then the tiger shows up. It's unconscionable. Yeah. Every time. My favorite part about that scene, too, when he was describing how he's an interdimensional alien space clock or whatever the fuck he was talking about. <laughs> <laughs> was that he literally just starts listing off, like, terms about, like, outer space. He's oh, just yeah. like, wormhole. <laughs> black hole galileo <laughs> yeah you like what <laughs> telescope horsehead nebula <laughs> but it was i think he was trying to just like describe like how he travels it was it was the like description from oh, the yeah, Ben horizon the, yeah he, give, does he gets the, a piece he, of rubber pipe yeah, and then he's like the i'm here the and this is the end of eternity and i can travel to both and like, then he like bends it and touches it. them together yeah uh, but he like, definitely saw her Event Horizon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's his yeah. favorite movie. Yeah. Probably, yeah. Or he read those rude. books that he got out from the library that show up in the movie all over the place. <laughs> <laughs> all, over the, all over the kids' beds. Um, but then what the fuck happens after that? I feel like this is when... Oh, this right, is when he... Yeah, that's what he's like. Uh, this, this is, this is when right, he, I am light, and I'm here to do this, and that's what I'm going to do. Here. Yeah. Right? A is man in a trailer in the desert. It's like, I'm going to kill everyone on Earth that's bad. <laughs> yeah, okay. so yeah, anyone who's ever harmed another person, I'll kill him right it, now. You yeah. realize that he wrote a movie where he is he's better than all humanity, and he raptures, he anti-raptures all of Earth. Yeah. Yeah. He basically does I mean, the anti-rapture. The, 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 the second point that you just said where he raptures Earth is the only difference between every other movie that he's made, though, is that yeah. in every movie, he's just better than humanity. Like, yeah. Oh, no, yeah. And just, <laughs> and, and, but no one will listen to him. But yeah. this time he was like, no, nah, yeah. I think I'm just going to actually he, get rid of everyone He did it himself. He did it himself. He didn't make everybody shoot themselves. Nope. <laughs> like at the end of uh, Fateful Five. Right. Well, no... <laughs> Okay, he does make people just dissipate yeah. into nothing. But because the first piece they disappear, the people he does on the make bus. some people just die, like yeah. kill themselves. Yeah, yeah. Uh, what, yeah. Are the bus people the first people? No, the president is the first. Oh, person that's, that's right. That's that's he gets to the new the green the, screen the, news, yeah. thing, which was so weird. It was so they weird. They were so man. far. The shot is like <laughs> so far away. I wish it yeah. was even wider. Like, <laughs> that would be great. <laughs> That'd be great, dude. <laughs> dude, it's so good. Mm. That was it was so like overwhelming. Like the the yeah. green screen background oh, yeah, was yeah. just overwhelming because it was all like yeah. s- like monitors and like all kinds of shit, and it was just like and it's all inert. Nothing's moving. Yeah, nothing's There's moving. no like like if you fake a CNN, at least put some scroll at the bottom yeah, right. or something. Yeah. You can't. Yeah. do that it just it's just no but we he, he didn't find not... he didn't find a youtube video that explained how to put a scroll at the bottom of your video so. yeah but we weren't <laughs> he watching green it. something it was like oh well yeah that's that's all i need yeah we weren't <laughs> watching here. it from the vantage point of it being aired on television no we were watching from the because studio this, yeah. actually this all of this is hilarious because that scene starts with like kurt said like they count down they're just sitting there smiling and you hear a countdown, and then they go, "All right, commercial break." And you're like, "Wait a minute!" So they yeah. were just they count down to commercial staring break. at the live screen, yeah. smiling, doing nothing the yeah. whole time. And, and then, then the commercial is less than ten seconds long. Yeah, they come back in. Well, during with the, the ten- count in, and then they say one line of dialogue, and then the guy leans over and goes. You know, all these corrupt politicians are kind of like ruining the world, and and but they didn't count back out, and yeah. I was like, no, he's he saying it alive on yeah, TV, yeah. and we find out that it's like international news. Yeah, too. these people are basically talking to the earth, as far as media is concerned. <laughs> but, then, yeah, but also, again, with no count back in, the woman yeah. goes, uh, new, "Breaking news: uh, yeah, right. the president is missing." Yeah. <laughs> And then the guy goes, also breaking news, the Prime Minister of Canada is missing. <laughs> and then they're like, oh, and uh, also this guy's. And then they're just going, this person's missing. 
the CEO of a company. You, like, you're just like, what? Yeah. What is happening? I love that Neil Breen instantly thinks that if you're in uh, any sort of power, you're yeah. evil. Right. Yep. There's no You cannot run yet. a company yeah. without being, being fucking not terrible. Not, <laughs> you should be dead. If who you run he, a company, you deserve to die. That's how evil you are. <laughs> All Does those, he realize all that? All those sweet laptops that he just smashes <laughs> oh, to pieces yeah. like, all, all the day shit long. All he does in his movies are made by corporations. <laughs> yeah. And he doesn't, yeah. No, he builds all this on his own, yeah. man. Yeah. Oh, he builds laptops from scratch. That would be fucking amazing. <laughs> that would be fucking amazing. <laughs> Could you imagine powering on a computer made by Neil Breen? Neil Breen. <laughs> <laughs> Powered by Breen. Like he rendered all the metals and stuff for the circuit boards and everything. Jesus Christ. Holy it would shit. be the ugliest computer. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Weigh like 800 pounds and shit. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, what? the people start disappearing yeah. around the world. That's uh, when we cut to the car. That after yeah. that initial news thing is when we cut back to well, the cartel. Well, cut to another news lady at a different place. Oh, she man, also yeah. lists but off more people She's in the same missing. room. I know, but it's I didn't realize that the background first. over behind like yeah, the table yeah, like yeah. a little bit. Yeah, <laughs> It looked like it was a different news station, sort of. Well, at first, I guess. Yeah. But yeah, then you find out they're all in the same place. He has yeah. an editor. His name is that Master Gacomo guy or whatever. Mr. Oh, Gio That's the guy who shoots stuff when he's in the scene and who edits the movies. Oh, whoa. You should fire that guy. <laughs> no, you should, <laughs> you should give him drugs By and make way, him edit faster. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, just a little bit faster. By the way, going. The, we're going back to that countdown. Oh, yeah. uh, that was clearly Neil Breen's voice oh, yeah. uh, giving the countdown. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> clearly his voice but it cut that's after that initial scene it cuts back to the cartel and that's when that guy is like holding the gun yeah and it disappears and, it disappears. and then and then neil like, breen shows up like oh right? whoa what's going on and then neil, yeah neil breen's just in the truck and he goes you're free run <laughs> get out of here <laughs> fight <laughs> the politicians yes, yeah. go back <laughs> to your like, countries yeah he like calls for anarchy pretty yeah. much he's just screaming in their faces like these humans must be dead yeah tired by now they've been through hell back <laughs> Re revolt yeah burn it down and then he does this <laughs> like, and he then he goes to the woman the house with the women and he has to confront the like woman that's in charge and that's that was awesome. the best <laughs> that was that was one of the most like genuine like awesome like, wait, that's where i think yeah. that like that lady's not an actor like that's just yeah. when she fucking talks to people and she probably hates neil Brain. yeah yeah because yeah. he was like what you're doing is is not happening anymore this is over and then she was like this is over motherfucker <laughs> Yo, who, you, who do you think you are yeah. talking to me like this yeah and, oh, then, and then and then he was like uh <laughs> yes it is and she was like it is and he was like yes <laughs> <laughs> and, then, and then he slowly backs out of frame yeah, so, so they can fade can away yeah. so that they can do the dissolve <laughs> so good yeah so that they can make so her good. disappear without making him disappear <laughs> And then uh, it, he, like, yells at the ladies, and he's like, you're free, get out of here. And then it pans over to, like, the rest of the cartel members just fucking dead on the ground. <laughs> yeah, like, what happened? Like, not, not disappeared. Not disappeared, not disappeared just laying dead. <laughs> they survived the initial rapture. Yeah. And then... Yeah, and then he met that lady disappear. Is then, there a cut scene of him to him walking in the house, like breaking their neck? Yeah, like that, oh man, him. no, you he wouldn't cut that out. out. He, wouldn't, he wouldn't cut that out. He no. would leave that in. Yeah, that would have been in the trailer if that was like. Honestly, yeah, <laughs> he's like, so this is gonna get me laid. Yeah, man. yeah, like, this shot is so hot. <laughs> is this when? Does that when it cuts to him walking up to the fancy house? Yes. the all green screen yes. fancy. Yes. House. Another one of my favorite scenes in this movie. No, th and then this sequence is my favorite thing. It was pretty great. It was amazing because the fucking hubris to do that it was amazing it was me. amazing a real estate agent too there's right? a man that has access to homes yeah and he had a cocktail party a rich yeah. mansion cocktail party in which people stood in front of like google image jpeg yeah of like a fancy rooms. house yeah like he typed unreal. in nice rooms yeah. on google and put it behind people yeah it's, you can't who does that it was amazing it was so good so like <laughs> it was so fucking good and so he like walks up to the gate and there's like two security guards and he just makes them nope, disappear because like a security guards are bad people just inherently they're, yeah. Yeah. Fuck them. and they're, then they're protecting they're the rich oppressors. Yes, they're oppressors sure. but they they weren't cops they were security guards they're like just yeah they're just they're like just jobbers like, yeah dude's like guarding like the front gate to no, make as sure far as I like that you're more willing to believe a police officer <laughs> is evil enough to die than a guy who gets hired to just rough people up and keep them out of a place no, they yeah. just stand there and they're like they're like you know are you invited don't you no. see it's 
Neoprene <laughs> believes in guilt by association more than anything. Yeah, he really if does. Either, uh, yeah, he's okay. like George W. Bush. You're either for us or you're against. Yeah, us. no, There's he doesn't no... address that. I'd wonder how he feels about like police. I don't know. They're, they're not, they're in, not the in his movies. They're yeah. not in any of his movies. Yeah, maybe it could just be you can't afford the costumes in the car. Yeah. Yeah, um, but I mean, and then, you, you could just green screen yeah. a fucking car. Oh man, he green screens their clothes on, <laughs> so the people <laughs> standing like this. Christ. That would be fucking. Insane. Man, I want to try that. Yeah, so dude, like, you like, should, man. Like color yeah, forms, and then you like basically <laughs> yeah. for people. It's uh. just, like, weird <laughs> hey, what's, up, man? what's wrong here sir and then it's just like all your clothes are just moving terribly um <laughs> so yeah he they disappear and yeah. then his clothes change to it, nice like like a suit and tie suit and tie yeah and then he, he walks slowly then, towards the door which he is like triple the size yeah. of. <laughs> and then he doesn't so like it's geez. so awesome he doesn't but he doesn't even walk in and like open the door no. He phases into the building in the same way that he like phases into the cave by touching the rock wall. And then, and then they, it just sh- it cuts to a scene of, of him just standing in the middle of this group of people just talking about how bad they are. They're just sort of like, like I, I did this illegal thing today and it was great because it was illegal and yeah. fuck poor people. Yeah. And, and then he, he goes, that's cor- isn't that corrupt? Yeah, he does, and they show the same scene of him over saying over that like twice they cut in a row. A living room set, yeah, another set, different people say, dude, same thing. The only thing that would it's make just, this better ugh. is if it had like the stock footage watermark on it. Oh, Man. for the for the uh, yeah for the like the JPEG bottom. that would be amazing. Had, like, the, yeah, like, so, a like, sh- like a shutter stock, like a shutter stock. Holy yeah. shit, blew my mind. That, that would be, be amazing. So good. That'd be amazing. How many times do we see this? Is it like six? <laughs> Dude, it's like six. Or no, s- yeah, it's they like... make sure they make sure that like there's different groups like uh, gathered around each other. But they always, start like, to four mix. People. Yeah, they start to mix. Yeah, it starts to like mix up like who's who. But they make sure that like each Every person <laughs> says something. Like they make sure that all did something evil. Yeah, they all just talk about how like. Like I bribe people. I bribe people. One of them was like, I think supposed to be like, like a prostitute who was like talking about how she sleeps with all these like high power people and can convince them to vote the way that she wants them to vote. <laughs> oh yeah. And like all that kind of stuff. And like, and then like every time someone says something though, <laughs> Neil Breen says, isn't that something? Bad. Like, isn't, isn't that corrupt? Isn't, isn't that, that evil? Isn't that corruption? Yeah. Isn't that, yeah. Wrong. It reminded me of like a, uh, like, a fucking like local like lawyer ad or something yeah. like that where yeah, like yeah. someone's like doing something and then the lawyer like shows up on set and they're like that's you know illegal objection <laughs> or like something like that like it was Dude, the same thing he had like like a powdered wig on and he like a <laughs> I object I object <laughs> It did have the aesthetic of a mattress commercial. Yeah, no, it definitely did. Like Dude, no, it, you know what it reminded me of? Like, those people on the green screen reminded me of, like, those full motion video, like, point and click adventure games from oh, the yeah. 90s. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. uh, like, uh, Dragon Strike? It? Yeah, like Dragon Strike or, um, you know, oh shit, I forgot the name of it. The, the, Phantasmagoria yeah, and, like, that yeah. kind of was stuff. The, what was the Western one? Um, Maniac McGee. Oh, there's no, that. Uh, there was a Western one. Though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I that's forget. what it yeah, looked like. That's about, yeah. what it looked like. I expected like a mouse to come over and start clicking on items in the room to see if you could do anything. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that guy looks real stupid. Is God he damn it, man. <laughs> So um, then, yeah, well, then, that happens a bunch of times, and then it shows all the people go, "Who was that yeah, guy? Who was he? I don't know. I've never seen him before." And then it's him outside the building. And he he said, what does out. he say? Well, he phases out. He changes, changes his clothes, clothes back, back. Yeah. and then he says something like, "The only way to burn him down is to actually burn him, or something, something like that." Something like that. The like building explodes. I mean, quotes in quotes explodes. explodes behind yeah, the fire. There's happens. just like a yeah. yeah, just like a like a royal, royalty a free, a royalty free like. <laughs> You know, awesome, fire man. special effect happens. It's so good. Yeah, it was great. It was really, really good. And that good. whole scene is so long. Yeah. And, yeah, he killed yeah. blew them up. Yeah. They but, survived the initial rapture, too. That's yeah. what I don't understand. Well, that's the thing. That, that doesn't make any sense at all, either, because he says that he's rapturing all the bad people off the earth, and then, like, a bad guy shows up at the end of the movie. At, like, yeah, and, for and, no like, reason. And he's, well, he's okay, hold there. on. After this happens, yeah. we go back to the desert. Thank God. Right. We all thought the movie it. was over. Oh, that's... No, 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 no. Because no, 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 no. there's one more thing that happens just yet. Because yeah. yeah. we go back to the desert one last time, right? Because the science kids are still there. The science kids searching are... Searching around. Now they're with the old man. No, that happens after the newscasting scene. 
when they when the kids like finally show up and right you're right yeah because uh, oh, okay. I thought, yeah, I thought right. that the part with like the newscaster because we thought that the movie was ending like I, it, no no a... he's calling all the people and then it shows all the four newscasters in one shot yeah and then oh he that's shows right yeah, the cuts back to the second yeah. news she's like I heard something and then it cuts to the normal shot and she is there yeah she like teleported yeah. herself yeah. and then he shows up and says and he, well, like security he, security and he's like you're not going to need security because you don't exist. And then they're, <laughs> and then they're just gone. That's way, you're what, lying. No, on what TV. you just said, what you just said was way more clever than they're like what <laughs> actually said, was said in the movie. I think that he just said like security's gone and then they disappear. Like, and then, <laughs> possibly. I, I think that cutting this segment out and putting it on YouTube is worth it. Yeah. Just the, like from him saying, I am not of this world. <laughs> on his green yeah. screen set. Yeah. And then he goes on. He goes on a fucking tire. Well, it has yeah. to be. He is, it which has I, to be five I minutes. Love. Yeah. It has got to be five minutes. Yeah. If, no. it, if it's not. He just goes on a tirade basically listing everything that's bad. He's like, corporate lawyer. All the lawyers. Corporate are just, lawyer. Disappeared. CEO. Yeah. Corporations. Yeah. Like, he just goes on and on and on. And then he slips in there mm. as one of the things that's ruining the world. Political correctness. correctness. <laughs> <laughs> we all looked at each other like, what? <laughs> like, whoa, whoa. Like, honestly, his politics are not clear. No, there. I I don't really know what he's. I don't know he what he wants that. either. I don't know what he wants either. I mean, like, but he like, talks about equality and stuff. In yeah. I don't think he's like a Trump voter. I don't think he's that. No, but he's yeah. definitely. I don't know. I don't yeah. know. I, I don't know. I don't he, know. I don't know either. I, I, yeah. When he said that though, I was like, is this going to devolve into something yeah, like, dude, really yeah. like make America great again? Yeah. Or something? Yeah. Like, yeah. Well, there's a number of times. But he likes the environment too much and everything. Oh, well, yeah. no, there was that one. And he likes space. There was that one scene. There's <laughs> yeah, right. That one scene though, where he was saying like, we're all of the same human race. We're all this, we're all that. And I was like, when I, I what showed up later as like the, you know, against political correctness thing, I was expecting to show up here. I was expecting to be like, we all matter. All lives matter. Oh, all man. lives matter. Oh I sw- man. It I, got I, close. I know. Got I, really I close. really, really thought yeah. that he was going to say something like that. That would have been something else. That would have, that would have been next level. Like <laughs> fucking like, holy <laughs> shit. Yeah. Like, and if I'm correct in during this, there's no music, right? It's him just talking, no, right? Just talking. Yeah. There's no music. Like, like really for most, of, for most of the movie yeah. i don't think there's music here like no if there, there is, wasn't like, if, no, if there is it's bad music it was just him really and i don't think that like he, it, i don't think that it was scripted i think that he was just like speaking from the heart and just like really <laughs> fucking going for it <laughs> and like in that scene like in. i really i really honestly believe that because <laughs> yeah. they just keep cutting wide and close whenever yeah. he stops the thought yeah 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 and it, and it was and we ju- really thought that was like the end yeah i thought this is it this is the message of the oh, whole yeah. movie and then yeah. i looked at my phone and I found out there's 20 minutes yeah. left. Yeah. 20 minutes. What the minutes. hell could possibly happen in 20 minutes? Well, you know, we have science kids. Science kids. The adventure and, of the science and, kids. And a, we'll just, and a little fella named Jim show up. Well, hold on. Well, <laughs> oh, the science man. kids. Jim, thank God. Yeah. Jim All right. Here. So the science kids convince Neil Breen when he flies back from the global, the multi-global right. or multi-international information station or whatever the fuck he it called was, it. It was like the International Media Center. That's yeah, what right. I'm it. pretty sure that was the name and, of it. And uh, he, him flying back to wherever the fuck they are in the desert near the fenced area triggers the science kids and they corral this old man to leave a hospital yeah. in a wheelchair so they can wheel him around with an oxygen tank dude it's in so the awesome desert. the shots of them trying to push him over the gravel dude, was amazing so uncomfortable. Oh! <laughs> yeah. yeah like he looked like he was literally like afraid that they would do something that would end up resulting in him actually having a like ride around in a wheelchair oh, for the rest of his life yeah <laughs> uh so now they're searching the desert for star man and uh what um i think he saw the two girls the two girls like are just wandering yeah the aunt and the niece niece are like wandering and the niece get well no the niece and then this man just starts following them yeah isn't there the piano scene or something well that was way earlier in the movie yeah Fuck Who it. cares? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. that was way earlier. He it played matter. a broken piano. Yeah, Who gives Neil Breen picks a broken piano. We're done. Uh, <laughs> I have nothing else to say. The two girls are like walking away, and then all of a sudden, there's just some guy with a gun following them. Oh yeah, because we I were like, 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 like,
he was following no the, so he was following <laughs> them later because i you I, sure no yeah the scene with him oh, following them later God. resulted in like that confrontation between them but he shows up and he walks over the knockdown fence and it's just just like white trash guy and a wife beater and a gun uh like walking and then it cuts to the scene with uh neil right, talking right. to the kids uh and then um you know uh the kids want to go with them they're like take us with you and he's like no i can't take you with me just stay here oh that's right yeah that's right. and then in the meantime take though us with you yeah they want to go to space do they know yeah. what's happening yeah <laughs> i don't oh i mean if they watch do the we news, what does that mean oh, you know what? that's you. a really good question because there's a scene between them that's just like <laughs> remember they're just like so hey uh yeah did you write any songs and there's the girl on the other line, like, yeah, I wrote three songs today. I think they're really good. And then he goes, yeah, I wrote some as well. I'm really excited about them. Like, that phone conversation was so banal and useless. Yeah. Meanwhile, on television, there's people being like, the president is missing. <laughs> Everyone is disappearing. And those kids are like, yeah, I wrote like a couple songs. I think they're great. <laughs> also, we should say there was this whole, whole other subplot, too, about uh, power going out. Where their phones died? Remember? Because oh, they were like, uh, oh, no, my phone's dead. Mine, too. Oh, what's happening? And then, oh, yeah. then they, they come back home. They come back home, yeah. but it's like, what the fuck? Yeah. Is it, what does it's it matter? It's impossible to yeah. figure out what that meant. Um, <laughs> yeah, like, yeah, was he doing it? I don't know. What was going on? No, I don't I don't know. And then, well, then their phones turn back on, and they're like, oh, my God, our phones are back on. As if that was, and, like, something that uh, we should have like, cared about. Could you have used it since just then? Just like, plug it in it when you get back to your mom and dad's house. <laughs> Yeah, come on. What are you stupid? <laughs> right. <laughs> you already have a car waiting for you at the end of the yeah. desert road. Like, we're fine. And what so do you need a phone for? Then, um, while this was happening, the niece goes wandering off somewhere and disappears. And then the aunt comes and <laughs> right. finds Neil Breen. And she's like, oh, my niece is gone. Oh, she's gone. Right. I know where and to then, find her. And then she grabs Neil Breen and hugs him close. And then there's this scene of him, like, reaching oh, his arms out. And, like, hug? his hands, like, shaking, being like, I don't know what hug is. <laughs> but he gets it. He's like, oh. But at first, yeah. But before he hugs her, his hands go down south. <laughs> he did. <laughs> yeah, almost right, right back, back up. Yeah. Okay. yeah. But then he like hugs her. And, and then they go to the cave, And right? then they go to the cave. To you think before that scene, he was like, so I'm an alien. I'm, I'm going to like, I don't know about human bodies. Yeah, so yeah, like, yeah. Just don't, everything, don't. So if anything you feel, it's me it's, acting. Yeah. <laughs> I'm a method actor. I'm a method actor. Yeah, yeah. So I've never been turned on so before. So that boner is that's an alien's boner. <laughs> yeah, that's okay. an alien boner. Yeah. Yeah. You <laughs> if you feel and you just go with anything that happens. Like <laughs> you feel you need to. Um but then yeah, yeah they go to the cave. They go to the, cave the shadow cause, cave. Yeah, because the God the, damn we're the, all this the scene is in. insane. I love this so much. It's I love really this good. so much. Because the, the two of them walk into that hall, yeah. like long hall, and yeah. they hear like the scream. It's like a stock scream too. Yeah. And then we, we see shadows. Then they get in there, and then Neil Breen splits away from the uh, ant. ant yeah. And he's like climbing ladders and staring at stuff. Yeah, he stared at like a blue was. crevice at yeah, one point. Yeah. It was the like, fuck what the fuck was. are you doing? Yeah. yeah. You could not tell what he was looking no. at. No. Yeah. And then he's back with the, the ant again, and they're yeah. looking around. And then it cuts to <laughs> the. So I don't know. If, I don't remember if we said this or not. But there's this room in the cave that we've been panning across, like, every time we go to the cave. Uh, and it's got, like, a lantern, and it's got a vest on a plastic hanger. Which is hang- the double-down vest. It's a double-down vest, yeah. Uh, hanging from the wall of the cave, and, like, a bunch of, like, you know, like a dirty mattress. Like somebody's like been kind of living there. Yeah. It, yeah. And it goes down there, and the niece is sitting next to this, like, <laughs> guy. Some dude. Some dude in a <laughs> sleeveless yeah, shirt. Like, what We were all he? like, what the fuck is going on? And then he has... Uh, like a bunch of like shitty piping, like, piping, like sort of like flexible, it's like serrated, piping. flexible. Yeah, it's like flexi flexible. straw piping. Yeah, uh, and he just goes, yeah, I put this this piping over over my lantern, and it makes weird shadows on the walls. Oh, and she goes, oh, so that's how you created the legend of the ghost cave. Yeah. And we we're like, what the <laughs> fuck are you talking about? So the the shadows on the <laughs> yeah, wall. Yeah, the machine of the ghost cave. <laughs> no one is talking about a ghost cave on the movie. Uh, no, so we good. were looking at shots of it. Yeah, this yeah. scene really is like the best part. It, no, and this, just, is, and this is this. So you, this, this is that curveball. This woman was an immigrant. <laughs> she came from another country. <laughs> 
She's been here for what, like a day? Yeah. And she knows about the legend yeah. of the game. It's a very game. famous legend. Very, very famous legend. That has uh, some tie to the dot yeah, but and so Neil Breen. The entire okay. time you're... <laughs> 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 But like the entire time you're watching this movie, you're I was either expecting the cave to not be explained at all right. or to find out that it's some sort of like weird like the, bl black lodge like in Twin Peaks or something like yeah, that. The yeah. antithesis yeah. to the light guy. And then it turns out that it's some fucking dipshit in like a sleeveless shirt <laughs> with a baseball and, cap and you're entertaining himself by making weird shapes on the walls and shadows. And that's it. That's like, it. That's literally and it. And Neil and Breen he, confronts wait, him. Yeah, he goes, "Who are you?" And they show up and they're like you, we've saved you. And she's like, I'm fine. He's cool. And you're like, well, who are you? And he just goes, my name's Jim. <laughs> <laughs> and they're like, okay. Yeah. Well, let's no, get out of here. And Jim. And he's like, okay. No, when they're outside the cave, Let me there, grab Neil, my vest. Neil Breen is like, I'm glad I saved you. Yeah, you're free now. Like, you're free. <laughs> you from what? Like, what is happening? From, from the crippling social anxiety <laughs> that he has that drew, like, <laughs> sent him to the mines and where his only friends are fucking flexible like tubing tell shadows. Me, okay. <laughs> yeah, see, <laughs> tell me, how do you this is why I want to hear Neil Breed speak. I know. About like, how do you yeah. write that down? How do you know you what this means? He won't like, explain it. He he does not explain that kind of stuff. Like everyone, I've seen people ask him. Like I didn't see this in person, but on a video, someone was asking him about what all the baby heads at the end of uh, what is it? I am here now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, They were like, what does that mean? And then he just kind of paused for a second, and he was like, well, what do you think that means? And then everybody started booing him, like in the uh, yeah. audience, like they're all like, oh, come on. And like all that kind of stuff. And he's like, no, it's, it's up to you to figure out what that means. So like when it, when he gets confronted with these kinds of questions, similar, awesome. similar to when like somebody. It's, it's the same thing as the like I paid SAG actor rates. Right. Get off my yeah. dick. Yeah. He's like, it's art. Stop asking. Yeah. That. No, like, exactly. Exactly. It's like when, uh, you know, <laughs> that's uh, so awesome. When, it's when, when, people, when people asked him like whose influences were or, like that kind of stuff. And he just said on my own influence, like, you know, it's just I think that he just thinks that by being kind of aloof about it or being kind of like, you know, dismissive He's about untouchable. it. He's untouchable. Yeah. It, it, well, yeah. It, it, I think that he thinks that it legitimizes it because he doesn't necessarily have those answers. And when you come up with the answer, you're going to come up with a better answer than like right, what he know, does. What he does. Yeah. Um, so Jim the cave ghost boy. Yeah. And here's the thing too, man. Says, we whatever we interpret it as is it's the truth. Well, I and this, Jim, I, it's I just, our truth. I'm coming off of watching the new season of Twin Peaks, which yeah. is like just like real fucking all over the place and like real cryptic and like all right. that kind of shit and i've been lending the same like same kind of like room to <laughs> neil breen and being like well no if he named like her well his name is jim and the girl's name that he was talking to her name is kim kind of the same name there has to be some significance there. there and, and yeah. then like and then i'm like i'm not fucking watching the new twin peaks like he yeah. just was probably like oh oh I, I, got, I got 20 minutes left of this movie what am i gonna do with it oh what's a what's a guy's name jim jim's a guy's name yeah there's a guy named jim who lives in the cave well, when you look at the credits the credits was like eric the immigrant you know and like bob the immigrant jim the uh, boo like he didn't he didn't put any thought in a single no, character's yeah, the name the fact that they all had names is yeah. awesome it's hilarious yeah. and like, they, were, they could have just wrote immigrants and had immigrant number one two yeah. three four yeah. Yeah, yeah well i guess they did have speaking lines so yeah, he, had, still, to give him, he had, had to give them names. names. Yeah. Like, you don't have to give names. Well, you can just name number. But I wonder if it doesn't oh, no, yeah. be yeah. sag. So the, the, the Legend of the Cave Ghost was Jim. It was Jim. Just some, like... Something that we only knew about from cutscenes that were inserted into the movie yeah. completely... And then, and then they free him. Saying saying it right then and and then they free him. They free him. <laughs> And then he disappears. Free like, him. But then he doesn't he show up. Leave the right, cave he hangs out with them time. for the scene outside of the cave. And then, and then, he's then that's gone. it. And then he's gone. And then the dude with the gun in the shows like, white beater shows up. And then and the screaming woman goes, that is my husband. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. She's like, why are you he's doing this? Yeah, so now then... here's my question. Like <clears throat> this guy obviously hurt this woman before. Correct? Yeah. Wasn't, oh, why is he not? Raptured? Why isn't Neil Breen? Wasn't Neil Breen's whole thing to like rapture anybody that's ever because hurt anybody? Answer that know, for I me right now, man. I don't know. One guy. <laughs> hold on, I don't the think the one guy that I, survived he is watched, intimately involved with someone that he's been intimately involved with during this process. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. I'm just I, saying. <laughs> I mean, he attacked the news station. Yeah. So he knew about. Corruption through the news. He doesn't know about like everybody, everywhere. No, but 
How did he know about? Well, because I guess, those the women dude, that he's been escaped, escaped, escaped from. Three hundred million people. But it's three hundred million people. He said that shit. He, he did. did three hundred million. <laughs> number one. Number one. <laughs> they had fine. a count. Oh, yeah. He said that, right? Yeah, he yeah, said, no. I've okay, just, see, he said, I've just killed 300 million people. <laughs> yeah, I turned them to dust. <laughs> yeah, that's what he says on live TV after yeah. he just made people disappear. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's great. pretty great. Um, so that guy somehow uh, anyway, didn't make the yeah, first yeah, cut. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah he, he, took a, you know, he started at the top, get the big right, things right, out of the right, way. Right, and then, yeah, yeah, I think he hates politicians more than like spousal abusers. Yes. In, in Neil Breen's mind, it's like power. Well, what if he was trying to use this as a way, maybe he's beating and his wife or something or something Wait, he's trying to show nobody's that he's not married is he's he showing you that he's not married not as he must be married i would assume he is really i don't know maybe not <laughs> <laughs> to me this all comes off extremely lonely yeah i could see that it comes off as a guy who has illusions of grandeur in his in his mind yeah and he doesn't know how to really connect with people yeah especially probably women yeah well yeah i would agree mm-hmm. he just seems very lonely as yeah. a human being but i could be wrong he could be married yeah I just don't see a woman like marrying him. I, I don't know. He's creepy. Yeah, there's some creepy women out there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Anyway, you so, know what? I think yeah. all this happens before the Star Kids find him, actually, because when the Star Kids find him, that's when like they they, they add, he says you can't go with me, and then all of a sudden the, the guy in the wheelchair goes, "It's so beautiful." No, I could, wait to my no, home. No, 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 that yet. cuts that cuts to the oh, that's, that's, okay. that's at the very very end of the okay, movie. Okay, we're okay, at okay. nearly at the end. Anyway. Okay, that's, so, why I got confused. that's why I was like, "Oh wait a minute." So the ringer hasn't gone off yet, so we're doing good. Oh really? Yeah. Are you sure you said it? <laughs> <laughs> I feel like we've been talking for forever. Oh yeah, why didn't it go off? Uh-oh. Oh, <laughs> Yeah, we're half an hour over. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> uh, I said it for three thirty a.m. Oh, okay, oh, why. let's uh, wrap man. it up. It's okay, we can wrap it up. All let's right. wrap it up. So, uh, <laughs> real quick, Damn. I was I thought that too. I was yeah, like, wow, I, I looked at my phone and minute. it's like, my yeah, fault. it's close to four. I Whatever. <laughs> uh, so the uh, uh, the husband walks up to the wife, shoots the wife in the neck, shoots the niece in the neck. They die. In the neck. Neil Breen. <gasps> Just comes stands to there a point and like blank. lifts them up. Well, no, 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 he, he fuck, call he, me. He's just like, don't, don't shoot me. It's not going to do anything. And oh, then, right. and then he mind fucks him, so he shoots himself. He makes the guy, sh- makes the husband shoot himself. Then he comes over, brings the two girls back to life. They walk maybe ten feet, and then the niece drops to her knees, and she's like, I can't go any farther. I, I can't, can't go anymore. And she's like, you can. And I can't. I can't. I'm tired. I can't. I'm tired. I'm tired. Oh, you Please, I'm tired. you have to try. But yeah. Please, just keep arguing with me. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we gotta pat out this runtime. <laughs> yeah. And then, uh, unbelievable. And then, and then it cuts to <laughs> Neil Breen and uh, the ant, uh, and they are looking up at the sky at the sky dot. And then it turns to Aurora Borealis. Mm-hmm. And then it cuts they back to them. Pinkies. They touch pinkies. <laughs> Uh, and then it cuts back to them. Right. Oh, th- this makes no sense because they twiddle their pinkies while all this crazy shit's going right. on. The guy in the wheelchair is like, I, was just like, right, just like, yeah, I live see. to see it. Yeah. I'm alive. And then she goes, I'm going. And he goes, you are going. And then she didn't leave with him, did she? Oh, that's she? right. No. And then he left. She he didn't. And then, she's, and then, and then she, she was like, will I ever see you again? And he goes, probably, maybe. No, no he says, yes. Oh, you can right. te- me, teach me about feelings and empathy. <laughs> yeah, he does. And then it cuts to a shot of them standing in a field of dead bodies. A, oh, just yes. Like the desert is the floor of it's the like, desert. And he took like three pictures of a pot, pile of his friends yeah. and he just repeated it. Yeah. yeah. So there's one dude in a plaid shirt that you, you just see 900 constantly. times. It's amazing. Sticks out. Yeah, it's amazing. He shouldn't have been in a plaid but shirt. There, but there, I guess all like 300 million people he killed are there laying on the floor. I and, don't really know what and that and was. And it's supposed to be procession off the planet. And it's supposed like, to be romantic. And he the, walks towards the world Borealis yeah. as they all dissipate. And with then, him and then, and then he starts like f- turning into and then aurora his face borealis. turns into aurora borealis and then his face gets all like wiggly and like it looks like <laughs> yeah. like water for a yeah. second it's called he used the I turbulent love, displacement effect there you go you can i love that you can see the edges of it i like, know very yeah, clearly yeah, defined yeah. rectangle it's so of the effect. my favorite i think my favorite part of the filmmaking criticism i can make <laughs> on this scene was the old man because to have to have someone scream out, I live to see it, and then Not you show don't that. see whatever it is yeah. for like two minutes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't show a shot of like from the back with his head staring up at it. 
nothing. Yeah. yeah. It's just a scene of them amazing. talking. Yeah. And we were like, what is he looking, looking at? at? Yeah. Is it, how close are they and Neil Breen? Yeah. Well, I mean, I, it's extra funny because by the time you do see what they're looking at, the dead bodies are there. And he's like, <laughs> it's beautiful. And, and there's like millions of dead, dead people bo- everywhere. Yeah. 300 million dead people. I yeah. live long enough to see God, it. Yeah. To see <laughs> half the world die. <laughs> <laughs> the culling, finally. <laughs> I guess he was like what he was supposed to be like an astronaut or like a astronomer. He was like an astronomer that like the little kids were friends with or something like that. He was like yeah, and he knew that a space god was coming to call the fucking evil people. I guess I don't know. It's awesome. Yeah, and then he walks until. He turns Oblivion. back into yeah. a dot, and he's the dot. And, and then, the dot. The, and then the dot shows up in the middle of the thing that we saw at the very beginning of the movie, the yeah, uh, space, the, the space sphere. Graph. sphere. Yeah, and it, the and then, spirograph. And then it ends. <laughs> and, <laughs> and then it just over. sort of yeah. ends. Yeah, it just sort of ends. Like, yeah, it it ends on a JPEG and it began on a JPEG. Yeah, and... the fact that it doesn't end with that speech is mind numbing. I know. Well, I, I, I it, it's mind numbing until you realize that that happens an hour into the movie. And then you're like, there's you, still half an hour. You can, you can just like, you, like the rest of the movie, <laughs> the rest of the movie, you can just like visit, visibly see like Neil Breen's panic to like pad out the rest of the time. Like, I think, well, what was like what the, you the said, Star Kid thing was like, whatever happened to them, they didn't show up for like, I know, 40 minutes. minutes they were yeah. all front loaded and end loaded. Like, and there was all this stuff in the middle. And then when they showed back up, I was like, oh, I figured they were dead. I don't, <laughs> yeah, get, yeah. Like, they were just done. Dude, I, I, the I, I, kids. I figured, <laughs> I figured that they stopped doing science and started playing their songs and started to be yeah, right? like <laughs> comes back to just in a garage fuck science man this song yeah, is really yeah. cool my mom disappeared last night I don't know what's happening <laughs> wrote a song about it though check it out <laughs> and the song's about space pictures yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I think what you said too about him like legitimizing everything yeah. I think his quest for 90 minutes yeah. shows so hard in right. all of the movies. Yes, absolutely. This one especially. Yeah. It's so this many one, shots To him, it's like you pans. need to be... This is almost exactly 90 minutes. Yeah. It's like a, it's a, it's an hour and 28 yeah. minutes. Right. I think he, in his mind, you got to make it to 90 yep. so it's legitimately a full-length feature film. Yeah. You know, and he'll yeah. do he's anything just, to get there, but he doesn't have the, he doesn't have the content. Yeah. <laughs> or the know-how to do it. At, right. You know? Yeah. So it's almost just, like he makes checklists of like... Are these th- do these things are these things true? Like, yeah. did this happen? Did this happen? Yes, that stuff is all true. Yeah, whether the the quality of it is irrelevant. Yeah, and then like when he's writing a story, he's like, did I do this thing? Did that? Okay, all right. He's yeah. like, yeah, he's like, there are science kids, and they are they are did friends. I, did I think with did I, like science an old good? man who knows what's happening? But he doesn't like. I don't need to explain. How the they old know the man old man? What they're life actually doing. looking for a space god who I'm playing. Right. Nope. Yeah. Because, well, no, and because, like, I mean, it, it looks like it is, I mean, I would say that he definitely. We def- could be totally wrong. He could write this and be like, it's perfect. Yeah. And I have told, I have told the audience everything. Yeah. In detail. I mean, that's what, that's what I'm saying, man. That's what I'm saying. It's art. It's art. There's there, there's more there than what we're, we're seeing. Mm-hmm. It's kind of, and it really is kind of what separates him a little bit from, like, the other other people i think he's the best i mean out of, yeah, I out of like the bad filmmakers like the ones the that, bad filmmakers no but yeah, like yeah. the like the good bad ones that like you know everyone kind of gives you know a lot of credence to like i think he blows tommy was out of the water oh yeah i think i still like, enjoy Tommy. Wiseau. no i know i'm not saying that like this has ruined my enjoyment of those kinds no, of movies no, 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 yeah. but i think that he approaches it in in it's like almost weirder like more genuine way than a lot of these directors well, do. i think like okay, james, so like james Wynn and like you know tommy was and like those dudes like they're genuine and they're fucking like nuts, but I'll like this guy really commits himself to it. it I, uh, former guest of the show, Sean, who we, you know, he's been on a few Sean times. Jones, yeah. Sean Jones. Uh, we were talking about this on that thread. Yeah. And I said, there's a big difference is like James Neguin and Tommy Wiseau are trying to make Hollywood movies. Yes. Where, and I feel like Neil Breen is trying to be Jesus and save the world. Yeah. Mm hmm. No, he wants to There's change a difference. the world. There's a very palpable difference to those. And things. makes David Lynch movies, right? Like, but and but like not like when David Lynch was making Halloween, uh, no, no, uh, Hollywood no. movies. I think no, like, like everything you said about him wanting to make legitimate Hollywood movies yeah. is real. Yeah, but. It, there's the added thing where it's like he thinks he's saving the yeah. world and saying something very important. Yeah. Where I think that Tommy Wiseau was just trying to make a drama. Yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, same with James Gunn. He was trying to make a thriller, like a yeah, Hitchcock right. thriller. Yeah. They were trying to a make movies. Thriller. He's trying to literally 
like affect affect the, the zeitgeist world. of yeah. the world yeah. with, with these art with the yeah. art. It's different. You know, it's, it's amazing. Yeah, that's what, what yeah. makes it amazing. Imagine Neil Breen like gets his wish one day, and we're living in like anarchy fucking mad max 300 times. million people just disappear you know, but like then... mad max times can you imagine like him surviving in him it? surviving in like the post-apocalyptic <laughs> wasteland dude, he would be like fu- yeah he'd be he humongous looks man. like beef yeah, jerky like yeah. someone would just try to eat him i immediately. would give him 300 million dollars to make like a like a road warrior what if movie? he made blade yeah. runner 2049 or whatever jesus christ fuck dude That'd give be, him those could resources imagine, <laughs> could you imagine could you imagine <laughs> could you imagine how many laptops would be smashed in that movie <laughs> <laughs> How many cups He wouldn't of even watch Blade Runner. He oh, wouldn't watch no. the first one. Yeah, he would no, just be like, dude, all he I would hear it. from people giving him money was uh, make a movie. Yeah. He would not care <laughs> about anything. It'd be a, a nightmare. That'd be cool. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I love it. I love it. <laughs> Have you seen like the uh Chris McGlover movies? Yes. Yeah, yeah. So wh- <laughs> everything is fine. Yeah. Like it's fine. Everything it's, is fine. It's fine. Yeah. Everything is fine. The, yeah. It's so beautifully produced yeah like if he uh, and the content is like horse shit i love that i yeah, was yeah. like this is amazing it looks yeah, yeah. Like gorgeous yeah these amazing shots oh the and sets like, are great yeah, yeah. And like yeah. if neil breen could have that man like what would it be like it kind of is weird too because like crispin glover would be that guy now yeah if he he won't ever release these movies right but, yeah but he would be i think as famous as all these guys yeah if he did yeah yeah, yeah. dude it's fine everything fine is the craziest fucking thing i know i've, I've never seen a movie I'm, i will never oh, see a movie like that, that is again. like as ever. emotionally like involving as that movie you're just kind of like I, I love what i'm looking at i don't understand it i, I can't tell if i'm supposed <laughs> I, to laugh at it or not yeah i think I'm now I said, i'm watching real sex i don't know what's going on anymore i think i said to someone i it's kind so of good. hate the fact that i've seen it because yeah yeah because it's not a, i can never it's not available anywhere the right. so only bad. way i can ever see it again is to is see it. go yeah. to his road show to see yeah it so and i bad. can't i and when i describe <laughs> it to people when you describe it to people they're just like yeah whatever and i'm like you don't, don't understand yeah, yeah, yeah. what I'm when you saying. watch a guy who's never said a line on film before in a scene that looks like it's cost a million dollars and is and gorgeous. Guy, and a guy has cerebral palsy, is <laughs> delivering all of his lines and having sex and killing women. <laughs> it's, you don't understand. Yeah. It's the best movie ever fucking made as far as I'm concerned. I've never seen anything as entertaining no, yeah. as that. It's, it's, it, it's great. It's like, it's yeah, if Neil Breen had money... And kind of some more knowledge, you could make something yeah. on that level. Yeah, yeah. he. I, I, I don't think he, yeah, I he's wish. never going to get that money, no. unless the yeah. internet embraces him like Tommy Wiseau level. Yeah, but, but I mean, they're not because he's his Indiegogo has been up for like six months. Five thousand dollars. Like, ra- like raised five thousand out of the fifty grand. I think he's trying to like raise or yeah. something like that. But you know what the thing is? Is the room was embraced by like Hollywood celebrities. Yeah, right. And that's the difference. Right. Yeah. yeah. Obviously. Yeah. Obviously, like Neil Breen would have to have that renaissance, and I think Tommy Wiseau has already taken that thunder away, probably. Yeah, for at least ten years. Yeah. Unless I, I don't know though, man. I mean, I mean, I, you never know. I, I could see people like I don't know really picking up on this and like I don't know it becoming. I mean, something you went like to the that. thing like Pete was packed. Right? It, yeah, it was packed. I mean, I went to. I mean, there were two showings. Yeah, it was, but yeah. it was at the it was at the uh, uh, Philomoca, which is like very. It's kind of small. Oh, okay. okay. It's not like you know really really big. It's like. I'd say it's like half the size of like the wind up space or something like that. So okay. it's, it's, it's relatively small. Oh shit. That's really yeah, small. Yeah. Um, okay. Well, but, but I mean, damn, that was one we're fans. More. No, so, I love it. I love yeah, it. I mean, like, I feel like Fateful Findings is fantastic. Yeah. yeah where where, Fable did, Fable where, did, where does this movies. one raid on your guys's Brino meter? Uh, Fateful Findings. <laughs> Fateful Findings yes. one and double down after that. So and then I'd probably put this last. For watching it. Yeah. For yeah. watching it, it. This was unbearable, know, man. man. I am here now is terrible. <laughs> it's really but bad. But it has some great fucking shit. Like, yeah, I love the gangster stuff in it. Yeah, there's dialogue in it. Yeah, there's at least dialogue The gangster and stuff and the, like, you know, the whole thing with, the, like, the woman getting fired and all that. Yeah. <laughs> I really love that. Yeah. There's almost no dialogue in this one. There's yeah. very, very little. Like, I thought Double Down didn't have a lot of dialogue. This does not have much dialogue. Yeah. I feel safe saying that if you made like a supercut of his entire career so far, it would be the greatest supercut ever. It would be insane. Like, it'd, <laughs> it'd be insane. amazing. It would be insane. There would be nothing better, really. <laughs> um, no, I, I dug this one. I thought it was a lot of fun. Uh, I did too. It was I'm not hysterical. saying I hate it. Yeah, but I, I, I would definitely agree that it's sort of like, 
I don't know, somewhere in the middle for me. Faithful Findings though is Faithful Findings. Un- easily you can't the best. you can't fuck with that movie. <laughs> you can't you, you can't fuck with that movie. There's that's the something best. about that movie that's fucking like amazing. <laughs> yeah, that one's just like it moves unlike the other ones. Yeah, all the like arty ones where it's not like people doing stuff. It, they don't flow. It like, also has findings like, that goes. almost make sense, but don't. Yeah. Oh yeah, they're just, but just on the enough where of... it's fun. <laughs> yeah, like um, like like the whole like marriage thing. All yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It makes some sort of sense. His yeah. wife murders herself, and then he just finds a new girlfriend. Like, yeah, yeah whatever. Yeah, it's great. Yeah, why not? It's also got the <laughs> it's also got the pool party, right? Yeah, yeah it's got yeah, the yeah. pool party mm. where she oh. where she drops her uh, little notebook that says it's a wonderful day in it, and they both pick it up. God, what so, a movie. Fable yeah. Findings is great. Yeah, it had the fucking garbage bag room. I love that It kind of... <laughs> honestly, the other three are all kind of fuzzily ordered after that Yeah, movie. yeah, yeah. No, Fable Findings, I think, is the best one. I That's the one I'd probably want to watch in full. I don't know. Double Down. All it. the hacking and Double Down makes Yeah, Double Down's pretty me. funny. Like, yeah. It's hilarious. Him with the satellite. Sean did say car, something, shit. though, on that thread where he said, like, the his problem with Breen was that he doesn't, like, get better. At all, there's no, no improvement whatsoever. Yeah. Although I'd argue Wazo hasn't. Uh, if you watched, Tommy Wazo made some like web series that I tried watching with friends. The neighbors, the neighbors, it's awful. It's unbearable. It's, it's awful. not even. It's unwatchable, as in it hurts it's to watch because yeah. the sounds all blow out. Yeah, dude. <laughs> I saw that in the yeah. theater, man. Ooh. I saw it in a movie theater, and it sounded like somebody was playing the audio <laughs> on their fucking cell phone at the front of the, like the stage in like a bowl, like to make it like a little bit louder. Like it was insane. <laughs> it was it almost was insane. like how could somebody screw this up this bad? Yeah, I, mean, I was, it was like, is no one helping him? He was really fucked up. Mm. Is there no one helping him make it? Yeah, yeah. like I guess you. I like to to me when I look at Faithful Findings. And then the next two, I'm like, oh, okay, what happened? Yeah. Because you're kind of on a roll. Like, oh, yeah, that's what we said It was about... like fun bad, and then, was, whoa. <laughs> was Faithful Finding... I thought Faithful Findings came after... Is, and I thought, I am... I'm pretty sure it's two, isn't no, it? No, no, no. I Am Here Now is two. Two. Because Devil oh, okay. Down happened, and then I Am Here Now well, is like is less a... comprehensive. It's like yeah. worse... This is as a dip edited from than the first Three to one. four, this is... I, I can't believe that this is after Faithful Findings. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Because Faithful okay. Findings, really? Because yeah. Faithful Findings kind of makes sense. Yeah, but I and think then that he goes back to I think that deserts. he was, I think that he was trying to stay out of the desert. I think, that, I think that he was trying <laughs> to be more kind of like return to his like roots, roots. Yeah, and be like try to like be more like artsy and you know, I don't know. Mm-hmm. Well, he's never going to take any advice or criticism or yeah. read any criticism. Yeah. He's probably so why, never. So why are we even doing this then? Because it's huh? fun. No, I, I want to write. <laughs> yeah. I want to email him. I'm just gonna need to find his email address. I don't care if he ever reads them. I just email him like once a week. Yeah. I bet you know what I bet too. I bet there's been like a lot of people that offer to help him make movies, and he yeah. he rejects it. Yeah. Because no, he wouldn't want it. Yeah. Because yeah. they'll try to I'm help. Not, I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah. Uh, there's got to be. Yeah. And he's, and he doesn't want anyone else to say in anything. Right. Yeah. Well. Eh. God bless him. Keep making the same well, shit. Movie yeah. Over and over again. Jimmy, thanks for. Uh, doing this yeah this is a blast I thanks for getting me to download it yeah of course <laughs> it's on reddit just look it up yeah i guess i can put a link on the posting I, yeah i don't know if you want to do that <laughs> <laughs> it's a public link yeah i mean yeah it's hard to argue with he did, do he did that. you can't just do that yeah, he, yeah it's not it. um <laughs> i guess i'll see you guys next when uh i finally track down a copy of death nurse yeah too. when you get death nurse 2 let I me thought know you bought that nah dude i, I could have sworn you we both know. just assume you uh, own all movies for some yeah. reason i thought so. you like posted about like finding a copy no of it or no, no no at some point no okay not yet whenever you find well, a copy isn't right. it on dvd it's on dvd yeah i know we it's could just buy the same. DVD, but yeah. Yeah. We'll, wait. <laughs> we'll wait for the v- we'll wait for the VHS. Yeah. That's the proper way to watch yeah. it. It's fine. Sounds good. All right. This has been way too long. Yeah. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> You've just listened to Bonus Disc, available only on Thundergrunt. Questions, complaints, and movie suggestions can be posted to Facebook.com slash bonus disc. Opinions and criticisms of the hosts of Bonus Disc are 100% valid, even though they took the time to watch the movies you were too ignorant to appreciate. <laughs>